came and you know You said you'd stay by my side I'm sad all alone I wish you'd stay
Oh, hello. Hello, welcome to my stream, everyone. Happy Wednesday. Happy Magical Wednesday, where we're gonna play a magical game. We're gonna have book club. We're gonna um, review this book right here called The Book on Pie. We're gonna play Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Uh, we're gonna talk about hair and shirts and uh, happy hump day, yeah. I, I never say that. <laughs> Only other people say that. I don't know why. I've never called it hump day. I don't know. It sounds weird. Uh, I prefer Wednesday or a Wednesday. <laughs> it just sounds strange. Uh, hello, and thank you for coming. I haven't seen you guys in two whole days, where on Sunday we played Forza Horizon 5, I think. If, if my memory is correct, and had a good time, that was pretty fun. I uh, conquered the Goliath and lost, but whatever, it doesn't matter. Um, and what else? Well, over my two days off, I got a lot of rest. Thankfully, it felt great. Um, I went to my P.O. box, picked up this book from Steve. Steve, thank you for sending me a book on pie I that I didn't even know I needed, you know? You know when you don't have a book about pie and you just, you don't, it, you have a, a pie sized hole in your heart and then someone sends you a pie book and you're like, oh, I always wanted that. How did you know? Steve, thank you for sending this to me. <laughs> thank you. Yo, Abram. Abram, thank you for the $10 super chat. Yo, with the sticker of a little dog holding a heart. Where's my mug? Oh, I can see it in the camera. It's behind the uh, pie book. How do you grab a mug? Ugh. Let's put Abram on the mug. Thanks, Abram. Oh, the, the marker is writing beautifully today. Welcome to the mug, Abram. Just to start off the mug, winky face, yeah? You start the mug off. It's always appreciated. Get the mug warmed up. Well, I actually don't want the mug warm. I'm drinking cold liquids out of it today. Uh, so hello, and I'm so glad that you guys are here because, uh, you know, look at the amount of YouTube subs that we've got going here. 99,900,000 and only 100 left until we get 100 or less. Could be less. 100 or less till we get to 100,000 subscribers. 100 million subscribers on YouTube. Yeah. How crazy is that gonna be? I don't even know what we're gonna do for it. We're gonna hit that number and then I'm gonna plan a little event or a party or something. I'm gonna need your advice. Bake a pie from the book for 100,000 subs. <laughs> no, I want something, I want something, something. I don't know. Maybe not pie baking, maybe not cookie making, maybe something else. Am I gonna turn on the Twitch integration? Sneaky, sneaky smile. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Maybe I should. Okay, so there is Twitch integration with these games. There usually is, but it usually makes your life hell. Why would I want that? <laughs> is YouTube going to send you a plaque? They do, they do, uh, but it takes quite a while, so by that time I'll have 200,000. Do I have an Xbox Series X? Yes. 100k substream will be in a hot tub. Maybe fully clothed, probably. Not yet. Hello, you guys. I wanna say hi to everyone in chat because I'm so excited that a lot of you are showing up just for the beginning of Tiny Tina's Wonderlands on PC. I'm playing it uh, from the Epic Game Store and I wanna say thank you to the developer for sending me a copy of the game. They sent me a copy of the game. I'm not sponsored. This is not a sponsored uh, or paid stream or anything. They just simply gave me the key when I asked for it. So thank you. Am I going to do a WrestleMania watch along this Sunday? Uh, no, I don't think you're allowed to do that. Probably not. Because isn't that stuff pay-per-view? So it's like extra, extra, extra DMCA unfriendly. You know? Yeah. So hello everyone. Say hi in the chat. I would love to say hi back to you and then we will start the game. While you say hi, I will randomly choose a pie from the book and I will tell you about it, okay? Let's see, it's actually a very nice book. It's hardcover and very shiny. So Steve, uh, great book taste. 
He said, you're welcome. Uh, with Aaron Pie, is anything you want it to be? You just subbed a Trovo Ace Plus for a year. Nice icon there. Do you get a special icon for it? I don't see it. Say something in Trovo. All right. Okay, wait, that was nothing on that page. Hi, Yura. Hi, Smitten Kitten. Oh my God, other finishes. No, these are all lessons on pie. Hi, obligatory hello. <laughs> Steve said hi in trouble. Let's see your new um, icon. Oh, the little, it's like a little house or a crown. That's cool. Hello, Steve. Hello, Vela Steven. Hello, Vector. Hello, Frank. Natasha. Ross. Cataclysm. Hello, George. Natasha. I get, oh, wait, did I already say Natasha? I did. Uh, hello, Skog. Lapus. Hello, Sean. Stone fruit berry pie. Oh, yeah. What does that mean? Stone fruit, like a, a peach. Oh, no. Blood orange brulee pie. That looks scary and delicious at the same time. Hello, Ka937. Sweet potato and apple are the only pies that matter. Ooh, I love sweet potato. Hi, Crim Knight. Hey, hey, say, Haseo. Yo, Space Bar. Hey, Captain Ply and Sci Tech. Hey, yo, Chris and Tim. Watch along means watching with the viewers, not actually showing on the stream, Birdman. Oh, then I never do that. You never know. Maybe. Hello, JKT82. Hello, Lendril and Jeremy85 and Christine Otaku. I just like this on display here. There. Um, hello, J Junior Hellspawn. Hello, Carolus. Dreamer12. Play in the dark. Jason. Uh, Steve, you want to put in your order for a pie? That I, you don't want to eat the baking that I make. Trust me. <laughs> Unless it's cookies. I can I can bake cookies and those don't turn out like shit. Uh, my my pie cooking is not gonna be great. Uh, Yura, thank you for the 1058. Cheers to our lovely host and knocking down the door to 100,000 subscribers. Hell yes. Abram, get the fuck off there. Oh, I always miss the opportunity to bleep when I say the F. Yeah. Yura, welcome to the mug. It's a bit early in the stream for F words. Yo! Yura, thank you. You would try it? Well, it won't survive the mail, so trust me, <laughs> it's not gonna be good. <laughs> Next time I do some baking, though, yeah, I can send you some. But it'll have to be dry, dry cookies. Hey, Dustin. Hey, Abram. <laughs> we don't want the bleep. Well, YouTube might want the bleep right now because it's a bit early in the stream. And, uh, you know, sometimes they don't like it when you say that word. I know YouTube does have a favorite word. Whenever I say it, the view count just explodes. But I can't say it too early in the stream. We have to say it like after an hour, okay? Don't let me forget to say the word, okay? It's, I'll, I'll give you a preview. It's, it's really a good one. Yo, John. Hello, Pixel Geist. Hello, Sean and Inspect a Deck. Dreamer, one, two. <laughs> Hello, Dynamic Games. Hi. Hey, Carolus Miner and DJ David. Hello, Frank. Love the dress or top? It is a dress, but I have to wear pants with it because it's very, very short. I'll show it to you guys. It's a, it's a very nice dress. It's, it's one of my favorites. See, it's like this. And it has these little things in it that if you were a hoochie mama, you could wear it without pants. See, it's got these things. And it's like, um, it's got this thing. Whatever you want to call that. I have no idea what this is called. It's like a whole separate piece of fabric. It, there's like a seam here and everything. It's like a, like a little, I want to call it a bolero. Like it's like a tank top dress with a, a little bolero, um, short sleeve thing. It's a very long shirt. Yeah, but uh, I just can't wear dresses. Uh, or, or it's a, it's a boob window. Yeah, it's whatever. Um, it only becomes a window when you put something above the neckline. Otherwise, if you're wearing a tank top dress, no one's saying it's a boob window dress. It's just a, 
It's just a dress. But I do, um, I did pick up a one dress the other day from a Hoochie Mama store. And I think you guys are gonna like it. It's purple, really nice. It's got a really nice back and you guys can't see it because I never turn around. Do I even have a back? I don't know. Do I even have a butt? Probably not. It's always just in the chair. No one ever knows. Do I even have legs? Do I have feet? I fucking hope not. Thanks, iTech. It's a chimney, says Pixel Guys. It does keep you cool in the summer. For someone who claims not to be a hoochie mama, you sure shop there a lot. Yeah, well, I certainly modify the clothing uh, to make it a little bit more normal. <laughs> but I can't stop. I can't stop. If chat doesn't see it, it doesn't exist. Yeah, I've got so many dresses that I can't wear in the winter um, because they just, it doesn't make any sense to wear like a beautiful flowing hot pink long uh, tank top dress with like a frills and flowers all over it. Did I get a t-shirt? No, I didn't get any t-shirt. Did it say it was delivered? Because I didn't receive anything. Uh, you'll have to send me the tracking number if you sent me a shirt. She's hiding her wings. Yura, that's very sweet, but you guys know that I have horns. Maybe by the weekend. Yeah, maybe next week. Hoochie Mama off stream? Not even. No, I'm a pajama warrior off stream. <laughs> okay, now that there's 200 viewers in uh, YouTube, okay, guys, I think that that means we can start the game. Um, no, just kidding. I start it whenever. The vines are looking nice in the background. Thank you, I know they're nice, hey? These are the ones that Taxia sent me along with the lights. The truth is Megan is CGI, that's why she looks go so good never ages. Yeah, no, that's just makeup and good lighting. Uh, yeah, no, no, it's regular mail. Oh, that's why, yeah, just give it time. It'll take like three weeks. PJs are life, I know, I have some very nice pajamas too. Very nice from Costco. Oh, um, I'm playing this music in the background, and then I realized that I can I can s skip the song on my phone. Oh my god, it works! Spotify. Spotify. Wow. I'm impressed. Uh, yeah, I have some very nice uh, pajamas from Costco. They're like, um, flood pants. I don't know how to describe them. <laughs> they have like a, a really neat collar, and like they're like, uh, flood pants and the kind of like flared like little like palazzo plazzo pants. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, you guys, we're playing a game. We're playing a game. Here it is. Ten days email on the 21st. Okay, probably a few more days then, Steve. Welcome to my stream. Maybe it's the last stream that we have under a hundred thousand subscribers on YouTube. It could very well be the last stream where we have under a hundred thousand subscribers on YouTube. By the way, thank you for subscribing. The last person who subscribed on YouTube, Matt Chrisinger. Thank you. I also uh, thank you guys when you follow on Twitch and subscribe on YouTube. Um, unless I miss it by accident, but generally. Yo. Hey, Koja. Hi, Wouch. What is up? Capris, Pixel Geist. That's the word I was looking for. I was like, flood pants that are flared. <laughs> 100 hours stream when? Never! I put my health first and would never do anything to jeopardize that. And you guys wouldn't want that either, okay? Trust me. Welcome to my stream! Let's press play. New game or load character. No, new game. Difficulty. Relaxed, balanced, or intense? Um, I'm sure we'll play balanced. If you play relaxed, players deal 15% more damage, enemies deal 15% less. I don't know, let's play balanced. You're here for a thrilling battle between good and evil, the intended Tiny Tina's Wonderland experience, or if you're really crazy, you can play intense. Oof. Oh, you get bonus stuff if you choose intense, though. Uh, Twitch integration? I don't think so. You guys ruin every single Borderlands game that I've ever played when I do Twitch integration. You guys can suck it. 
Uh, I'm gonna play choose group mode. Oh, I'm not playing in a group, so this doesn't matter. But everyone in the group finds their own loot. Cooperation. 2K Games presents... A Gearbox software. Oh, look at those little bunny ears. There is a world beyond the borderlands. Oh, really? A world forged by wonder and ruled by fate. Was it bunkers? The battle between these powers has raged since the beginning. Evil and good. Villains and heroes. This is not very loud. A vicious cycle, endlessly repeated. Wonder is the power of a cruel, unpredictable god. But fate. There's one alone who can wield fate. Me! One alone whose story is in their own hands. The Fate Maker. That's you. Heavy, right? Fate Maker. Big responsibility. Honestly, I wouldn't even blame you if you just laid down in a puddle and gave up. <clears throat> but if not, if you try and prove yourself as Fate Maker, then heed the warning I give all heroes. Together you fight. Together you shall fall. Who am I gonna be? Wait, he gets to be a person now? Oh yeah, same. It's going real good over here, Blade Wise. We're coming for you, Dragon Lord. <laughs> Who's the Dragon Lord? Fools. Your party of heroes can't stop me. Already I... Wow, you guys got here fast. <laughs> like you said, we're the heroes. I am Valentine, gallant adventurer. The scary stabby one is Fred. What about that one? That's the newbie. <gasps> it's their first adventure. That's me! Oh, come on. Their figure isn't even fully painted. Enough talk. We're here to stop you from taking the soul energy. <laughs> Fools! I've already absorbed all of the soul energy. Do you really I use figures in D&D? I thought they yeah, that was just Warhammer. Oh, man. Sorry, newbie. We missed the soul energy. Cats will burn. Babies will cry. More than usual. My <laughs> skeleton armies will wash over the land. <laughs> Looking bad. How do we win this? We attack together. <laughs> now we suck. Pathetic. Especially you, newbie. They don't make heroes like they used to. Time to die. But then, just as the heroes lose hope. They hear a nay. <laughs> yeah, and also like you know, like a sparkly rainbow, which goes like crinkle, crack, crack. <laughs> Is she the dungeon master? <laughs> the most beautiful and perfectest ruler in all the land. Butt stallion. Hold on, what game are we playing here? We're, We're playing, playing bunkers and badasses, baby. <laughs> and I, Tiny Tina. Oh, am she the is the DM. Master. So what I say goes. And I say there's a magical diamond vinecorn named Butt Stallion who saves the day. Vinecorn? Oh. I was kind of hoping we would save the day. You will, Valley Girl. I just gotta set the stakes. Now, let's table talk. Cue Dragon Lord! Yo, Day Summon, thank you for renewing your subscription on Trovo. Oh, 21 months. You and the unicorn? The Thank you. Hello. But this time, I won. But, Buck Stallion was wielding the coolest sword in the whole world. In its mouth? The sword of soul. I forget so much of the Tiny Tina lore. I played all of the Borderlands, but oh, not to completion. You? I just made those skeletons. <laughs> no. Rainbow no! chains. I curse you, Valentine. I curse you, Fred. And most of all, <laughs> I curse you, newbie. I didn't do anything. Whatever your name is, I will return 
and finally rid this world of heroes. What did she put him in? A D? What are those called? A D twenty? And with that, the Dragon Lord was defeated. I always forget the name of those. <laughs> Me. Yeah, might as well. We're stranded here after that mountain totally jumped out at our ship. <laughs> yeah, he crashed it. I'm in. I love bunkers and bags. Wait, that's not the same robot. I've already got a level 40 character. Clap. Now, now, we are making Trap. all new characters. This is the newbie's first game, and I'm going to make sure it's an adventure they'll never forget. You ready, newbie? Yes, no, what am I going to be? Sheets, baby! Yes. Let's make my character. Oh my god, what am I gonna be? I have no idea. Okay, I can be so many different things. Have I played this before? No, I've played Borderlands. Like, uh, all of the Borderlands games. This is a brand new game. Uh, I never played the Borderlands 2 DLC. Okay, technically I didn't play all of them if I didn't play all the DLCs. But I found the DLCs were kind of the same thing over and over again. Uh, Tiny Tina's voice is Aloy's also. Oh, Ashley Birch? Really? Is that her? Is that Wanda Sykes voicing the robot? No. Wait, where's Claptrap? In in one of the Borderlands at the end of it, did Claptrap turn into like a bipedal robot? Okay, I can be a stabomancer, a sneaky murderer with focus on crits, no. A clawbringer, wyvern tamer with focus on fire and lightning damage. Perhaps. Okay, so previously you could have been a sniper with a bird, couldn't you have? I remember that one. Spell shot magic user with focus on constantly casting spells. That sounds like something I would do. Graveborn soul trapper with focus on dealing damage in exchange for health. Ooh, a necromancer. Spore warden fungal friend with focus on range damage. Ooh, I love ranged classes, but uh, I also love magic classes. Berserker. I love berserkies. Angry smasher with focus on frost. Okay, I love a berserker. There's nothing bad about that. It did sound like Wanda. I did not hear it. I mean, I heard it, but I didn't hear Wanda in the voice. Really? Who the hell is Fret, though? I don't remember that from a previous Borderlands. Okay, so I definitely don't want a Stabby. Why does he look purple there? Is that broken? He's just, oh, that's just his invisibility thing. Okay. Uh, thank you for the subscribes on YouTube, Jaden York, Stellar J, uh, negative ROG, thanks guys. And I, Stellar J, by the way, I love Stellar J's, those are very beautiful bird. Um, do look them up if you feel like it, they're the most beautiful shade of blue-black you'll ever see. Andy Samberg is apparently in this too. Okay, so my choice is, oh man, Spore Warden sounds cool. So what do you do? Mushroom Companion that targets nearby enemies and deals poison damage. Action skill is Barrage. Ethereal Bow firing seven arrows to deal ability damage. See you guys, I love, I love um, ranged combat because it doesn't make the screen go crazy the way that a Berserker would. Berserker is gonna run in there, smash, smash, smash. The, the whole screen is gonna be a huge blur to you guys. But a steady shot of a ranged character perhaps would look good on stream uh he also has creates three frost cyclones for a duration that seek out nearby enemies dealing frost ability damage over time so maybe i mean it may not be as exciting though you know as a spell shot who focuses on constantly casting spells i like the sound of that um, spell weaving. Casting a spell. Okay, it's behind my head. You guys can't see it. Casting a spell or reloading grants the fate maker a stack of spell weaving. Increasing spell damage. Spell weaving stacks automatically decay after a few seconds. Okay, so you have to constantly cast to get the bonuses. So this could be very loud. This could be like pew, 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 pew. The whole time the game is playing. Polymorph. The fate maker magically turns an enemy into a harmless skeep for a few seconds. Oh. Ambihextrous. The fate maker may equip a secondary spell in their inventory. Wherever the fate maker presses RB, they cast that spell. Um, and then what was the electricity and something else? Oh man, so two different kinds of spells, eh? Clawbringer is a... Oh, I like the look of that too. Okay, it has a wyvern companion that attacks enemies with fire damage. Clawbringer also has Fate Maker summons their hammer and slams it to the ground, dealing melee, fire nova, action skill is storm dragon's judgment, 
Melee damage, lightning melee, ability damage. Ooh, and then Berserker is action skill start. The Fate Maker comes enraged. So you have to deal with Berserky mode. And there's only so many times I can say Berserker without it coming out as Berserky. Uh, so you guys will be upset about that. Um, so it's between Spore Warden and fuck. I See, I never play Necromancer. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's too complicated usually. But it does sound fucking good. Spore Warden. Uh, yeah, I love the sound of this Mushroom Pell too. Ooh. You think Berserker or Clawbringer? A Clawbringer is great, but I hate Hammer. I, I'm not big on hammer. I like I like a one-handed axe. I don't like a two-handed hammer or axe. Um, man, bows are just so good. And there's nothing that says that... And I'm just... I'm so fast with a bow. Or spell shot. What's more fun? What do you guys think? Okay, tell me what do you think. Spell shot or spore warden? Say in the chat and give me an idea of what you guys want to see. You want to see a, a magician shooting fireballs and all sorts of balls out of their hands? Or do you want to see a mushroom guy? You try not to think? Well, just do a little bit of thinking for me right now. And think, do you want to see a mushroom um, a mushroom guy with a bow? Or do you want to see a, a guy with um, magic coming out of his fingertips? Abram is playing as Clawbringer. Yeah, you would. YouTube poll? Nah, nah. No one ever touches the YouTube polls. I just like it when you guys type. Uh, spell shot, spell shot, spell shot, spell shot. Spore, spore. Spore, spore. Spell, spell. Spell, spell shot, spell shot. Spore. Magic fingertips, spell shot, spell shot. Spore, spell shot, spore, spore. Hmm, spell shot. Shoot out of fingertips, that's in a spell shot. Uh, it is like two thirds, um... You wanna see a headshot counter? Oh, there'll be too many. It'll just, it'll just go over. Okay, more spell shots than spores, guys. You have made your decision. It's, uh, it's pretty close, though. When I count... No mouse and keyboard? No, I don't feel like it. Yeah, it's gonna be spells. Uh, way more spell shots. Okay. You guys have made your decision. There is more votes for spell shot than there is for Spore Warden. They both use spells also. Oh, well. Then, good. I'll have both hands doing spells. Okay, so continue. Now, oh my god, I have to do this stuff too? Shit, okay, good thing we didn't take too long to do that. Um, so I need body and personality. Body type, that one. This one. That one. Uh, let's go with, uh, this one. Body size, real big. Huge, I want huge. Head size, fucking massive. Can I rotate? Oh yes, I can. What, that's not even a big head. That's like my head size, that's fucking, that's normal. Let's make the head huge. Personality? I'm at a loss for words at my beauty. <laughs> I'm at a loss for words at my beauty. What? I'm vain. Get over it. What? I'm vain. Get over it. Oh, that's cool. My image is in need of refine. Strange. Something has to change. Ha! Justice is always in fat. You animal, you. Gods, you're good. <laughs> that one. Voice pitch? Oh, yeah. I definitely made the right choice. Okay, what p what pitch is my voice? Here's me normally talking. How's I'm at a loss for what? Now that is a look. Now that is a look. Yeah, that sounds like me. Pronouns they, them, she, her, he, him. I'm going to be she, her. And then accept, randomize. Okay, back, continue. Facial features. I don't think you see their face very often, do you? Head shape, graceful, reserved, hardened, aquiline. Oh. Does that say aquanine? No, it's aquiline. I forget what that means. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. These are all fucking cute. Refined. What does a noble face look like? Inbred? 
I want to be graceful. Skin color. Newbie. Human. Human. These are all human. Oh, wait. Oh, Fort Exhumed. Forge Blood. Can I be green? Deep One Cloud Kin. Oh, that's cute. Astral Void Soul Scales. Whoa. Newbie. I think I want to be green. Yeah, that looks cool. Hair and headgear. Oh! What? Oh, cat ears? Yep, probably gonna have to do cat ears. Edgy backstory? Oh my god. Or Karen. That's adorable. Unkempt. Is there other any other um, cat ears? Because I think we just have to do cat ears. Facial and hair masks? No, I don't have a mustache in real life. Hair color. We're gonna have to make it my hair color. Bronze. Neutral red. Natural red. Mine is unnatural red. Do they have that? Oh, warlocks. That's cool. Okay, ear symmetry. You can't see my ears. Can you? Ear shape. Pointed up. Some appear disabled due to symmetry settings. Ear symmetry on. Pointed up. No, it doesn't let me change that. Nose shape. Oh my god, there's so much to do here. Soft. What so nose do I have? Soft nose. Sure. Nose size. Make it very small. Uh, I'm a little bit bigger. Uh, mouth symmetry. Sure. Mouth shape. Thin. Wide. Bowed. Full. Heart. Oh, I want heart. That's cute. I'm not sure I'm loving the skin color anymore. I wish it was darker green. Like a deeper, like a ocean green. Can I change the skin? I wish it was like solid green too, not scaly. Oh, no. Forge blood. Um, eyebrows sharp, plucked, arched. Eyelashes, big ones. Huge! Long. Eye shape. Deep, wide. Oh, she looks crazy. Uh, what eyes do I have? Normal, sunken, reptilian. Ooh. Smooth. Let's do smooth eyes. Pupils, dot. Yes. No, let's not make her that creepy. Eye color blue, left eye size. Oh, you can make them have one big eye and one little eye? Continue. Oh, that, that's very cute. That's a good one. Megan, do you have a mustache? I do not! Thank you guys for liking the stream on YouTube. I appreciate it. We're at 170 likes. You guys. Face decoration. Scars, tattoos. What kind of tattoo do you have? Ooh. There's only a handful of them. I want vanishing trail. Tattoo color. Red. Eyeliner? Why not? Why not, fucking eyeliner? Red eyeliner? Yeah, everything red. Eyeshadow? Everything red. Hazy shade smoke ring, I like that. Can't really tell here. Golem glam. Blush? Blush color, no lipstick? She needs a bit of lipstick. Indulgent! No, we don't overline our lips that much! Just a bit. Peach. Okay, armor decoration. Armor pattern. Where? Where is it showing that? Oh, it shows you on crosshatch, strike and lichen, high elf fashion. Am I an elf or am I a cat? Also, it didn't let me change the color of my ears, you guys. Am I supposed to be able to do that? I like strike and lichen. Oh, look at all these. I want strike and lichen for everything. <gasps> chainmail, yes, we're doing chainmail. Primary color unpainted. Oh, yeah, I want green. I want green. Oh, yellow. I want yellow. Secondary color. Yo, Joey, thanks for subscribing on YouTube. Oh, this is so fucking cool how you can change all of this. I didn't think that they would do this. I really like the look of this orange and yellow. Oh, man. Tertiary color. What does tertiary mean? 
just like little edges. Oh, that's neat. Oh, that blue is very striking. Purple, pink. Oh, I like this red. 25 carats. So what about the gray edges around everything? That's just what you get? Isn't she cool looking? It's a sweet cat lady. Oh my gosh, what's this? Oh, you just get to see what it looks like in your colors. That is so cool. Wait, you get to choose it like this too? I didn't even... I was just scrolling through it. Okay, go back. Um, presets? No. What's slider overdrive? I'll just press continue. Oh, my ears are painted orange now. That worked. Okay, archetype. Thick. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, you sweet large child blessed with looks. Oh, blessed with looks. Muscles and exactly two brain cells that never call each other. You are made in the image of the gods, specifically Belotheon, god of himbos. You are always destined either for greatness or to be legally categorized as construction equipment. So that gives me huge strength, low intelligence. Uh, what I want since I'm a... I'm pretty sure usually you want high intel for um, magic casters. So this is high dex, low constitution. This is high intelligence, high wisdom, low strength, low dexterity. So if I'm doing range, it's often dexterity and intelligence you want. Failed monk. Um, pack rat. That's attunement, skill cooldown, spell cooldown. Um, okay, wait, it actually says right there. You guys can see it, um, but not really behind me. So there's crit damage, crit chance, spell cooldown, status damage, max HP, and skill cooldown. So none of these actually affect um, uh, spell damage. It's mostly just strength is damage. Little fifth element humor there. I freaking missed it. Blue and orange complementary colors. That's why they were so pretty together. But I chose the 25 carat because I wanted that extra glow. Okay, so let's go crit chance, max HP slash ward. No, I want lots of ward, I think. Spell cooldown and status damage. We can have lower crits, lower crit chance, but we can have good cooldown and good status damage. Because um, what we're doing... Okay, wait. Archetype nerd. A powerful calling led you to leave your life behind and travel to a mountain monastery uh, where you could learn ancient teachings and contemplate the meaning of all things in peace. Then you emptied a chamber pot out the window and hit the head of monk mid yawn, fearing that vows of nonviolence can only extend so far. You fled in the night seeking another calling. Yeah, let's do this one. Failed monk. Because um, I don't. Um, damage is so important, so is crit. Uh, but cooldown and status damage is really important too. And that's the only one that I can see, unless it's Alchemist that I go with. And that's huge status damage with wisdom. The Royal Alchemist Society strictly regu regulates transmutation magic. Screw those guys, you made a name for yourself, hawking off brand affordable jewelry, but are recently unemployed and on the run after local baron discovered his new golden amulet was made of chocolate. <laughs> How would they know? It was transmuted into gold. Um, or just, uh, hmm, is there, st I, I'm doing status damage, I think, right? Because I have two hands, one is electricity and one is something else. Let's choose Rogue Alchemist, why not change it? Oh my god, now I have to it, put my points in. Okay, best for Clawbringer, Stabomancer, okay, so it's suggesting dexterity, intelligence, dexterity and intelligence, just as I presumed. So right now I got 10 out of 38 out of 28. What the hell are these numbers? 18 out of 38. I will max out what they recommend. The measure of your weapon precision, it determines whether or not you could not hit a cow's arse with a banjo. <laughs> and since I'm already doing Rogue Alchemist, I'm getting minus two dexterity. I should put two to replace it. And how many points? Uh, eight available, okay. Intelligence also, let's go two points there. Uh, wisdom is status damage. Let's go strength, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, that's crit hit damage. Measure of your physical might. Uh, well, actually, hold on. This is recommended for spell shots. So let's go one, two, three, four, five in this one, one in this one, and then two more in intelligence, and let's do that. I can't believe they, um... I can't believe they didn't do this in other Borderlands. Did they? 
in any of the DLCs, were you able to change stats like that? I can't remember. Okay, here's my character. I'm a spell shot. And I'm looking cool, too. Hope you guys like her. No strength? What do you mean, no strength? Well, I only put one point in strength. She looks fucking great. It's a first for Borderlands, so they never did it in any of the DLCs, anything like this. Too bad. It's a great idea. I'm glad that they're doing it now. Okay. Wait, uh, use right stick to look around? You've just drawn your own face over the character sheet? It said draw your hero, and I'm my own hero. Okay. And Fret, it says your starter sword does murder a thousand damage? My bad. I left off a zero. Okay, no plan! Fred and Valentine can't be trusted with pencils, let alone dice. So it is up to you. <laughs> you are the fate maker. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And these fools shall be thine advisors. Mm -hmm. Fine. I advise that you better be a badass. We're here to slay Hold on. people and get gold. Oh, it totally I is. You see me as a role model. Follow my lead and you'll be a great fate maker. All right, one last thing. Bunkers and Badasses is a role-playing game, baby. That means you do not break character voice. Kapiski? Ooh! Break me off a piece of that. <laughs> I have owned my skills over a lifetime of mischief. It's time I take on a real challenge. Mmm, <laughs> mmm! Tasty! <laughs> now, prepare to enter a world of fantasy! Uh, enter it! I don't see anything. Where is it? Imagine it, Oh. Just close your eyes and wonder. Okay. You have arrived in the snoring valley, an unassuming and peaceful corner of the queen. Oh. Harbors a dark secret. Dun, dun. You journeyed far to be here, heeding the call of the queen herself. <gasps> the queen herself? She want of us. Yes, what? She fears the dragon lord will soon reawaken. You must find his tomb and prevent his resurrection. What I'm hearing is Let's open these boxes. Uh, here's a little cheat sheet to track your health and map and stuff. Up. Okay, the blue diamond waypoint, do, uh, do blue diamond icon, duh, um, is your waypoint. Follow it to your next, next objective. If you're too far away from a waypoint and it doesn't appear on your HUD, follow the arrow something something and disappear. Okay. So, uh, I wonder if I can change the FOV. I'm feeling like I would like to. Uh, let's see, visuals, aspect ratio. Can you ever change the field of view? Yes, you can. Let's go in 100. Yes. Ah, that's better. That's much better. Okay, follow Clopping Road. Mm-hmm. Oh, look at this cart. I want to repair it. Okay, let's, let's go. Okay. It's not attaching to me! I want to open boxes and shit. Let me in there. Okay, running is still like that. I'm on top of this house. I put everything on ultra, like the, the highest uh, that it can go. What's up here? Another box? The robot's voice is familiar! Guess who it is? Guess who it is? I'm gonna run back here for a sec, because I want to know what's going on. Okay, I just have to get uh, reacquainted with this game. It's been a while since I've played. I got some shit. Uh, bunkers and banners. So if I press left or right on the D-pad, nothing changes because I only have one quest right now. If I use this, I don't need to because there's no overworld yet that I know of. So I'm following this road as it's said. I really hope the volume is good enough for you guys. Um, picked up gold complete. Okay. Cryptocurrency. Okay. <laughs> That's funny! Everything in this game is a joke. If you guys are unfamiliar with this, um, and you want to play it for the first time, especially any Borderlands game, give yourself time to play and read almost everything, because I always found that there's a joke in every single thing that they say. No matter what, there will be something. Bridge is out. This would hurt me. <laughs> Why don't we pay taxes? Maybe we're not from here. 
And sometimes these ga games do reward you for going off and looking at stuff. But I want to find out what's going on in this road. You recognize one of the queen's waystones. It seems to call to you. I do recognize it, sure. Enters you through the stone, granting you the power of... Ba -ba 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 you now have magical sight and hair in the Queen <laughs> Butt Stallion. She's guiding us on our quest. Oh. Sure enough, baby. A trail of spectral hoof prints leads off into the woods. I'm going to follow those in a second. I just got to look around here for a second because I thought I saw something on the roof. I did. It was mushrooms and it's not for me. Never mind. I'm following the spectral hoof prints because the bridge is out. Let's go, the butt stallion. Oh, no, my God. Wait, they're disappearing. There's too much to look at. I got to open this. I need the money. I'm gonna jump. Identify tree. It's a species called Jumpus tutorialis. <laughs> and weirdly, it only grows in this one valley. Let me check the volume options here. Uh, I have everything on 100. Sound mode, small speaker. Hi fi, nighttime, mono, headphones. Uh, I don't know what I want. I'll try headphones and see what it sounds like. Does that boost the audio? Jump! So I guess you, um, you spend so much time making your character beautiful because I'm hoping that maybe in the cutscenes uh, you see them. Because you don't see them while you're playing. I think you see them in the cutscenes. A uh, butt stallion! Ahead, the glint of edge steel beckons you forward. Some hot lumberjane has left her axe in a stump. Has she now? Hold on, I, there's a thing. Whenever you look on the mini-map, you guys can see on the mini-map, there's a big blue thing, and I have to get this. Hatchet of Downfalls. I'll take it. All the things I could chop with this. Can I chop the box? Right for cleaving, hacking, whack things, girl. press right stick. Chop, chop. Oh, yes. I'm gonna go whack stuff with it now. <laughs> I'm gonna whack my way in there. But first, I'm gonna look over here because there's a box. And maybe the game will reward me for breaking a box. No, it won't. No rewards. Oh, I'm gonna break this barrel. Screw the person who spent 12 hours making that. Do you guys feel like FOV 100 is good enough? I feel like it's good. I would go crazy with a higher one. Be to crouch in a good way. And when to crouch. Did the devs give you any skeleton yeah, keys? No, I just got the I just got the key. Crouch, Ooh, cool. slide. Yeah. Oh, you can slide into boxes too. I'm hearing some sparkling. Where is that? Oh, one posted on Twitter. How do I redeem those if not in the game? Oh, don't I have to go to shift keys, shift code keys? Shift code keys. Um, how do you... Couldn't you do it on the website before the Borderlands account? In menu or a chest in game. I swear there was something because... Um, there's no way I was entering those codes manually before. You can do it on the website. So, what website? Borderlands? Shift.gearbox software. Yes, that's the one. Okay, let me sign into that. Um, rewards, I think you go to. Borderlands. Okay, I'm going to copy that one. Yeah, if you guys know any shift code keys, uh... Redeem for Xbox Live. What happens if I do that? No, Epic Games. It says it's only for Xbox. Skeleton key. Uh, it might, it might, it might have worked. Yeah, if you guys have any shift codes or anything, or you see any that I haven't uh, entered already, 
ammo full. Okay, so now if I want to go social, find shift friends. Oh, I thought it said shit friends. Um, I got to go to mail, new content available. Golden character armor preset. What? I'm going to accept. Why didn't I get golden character? Follow these steps to link your account. No, I have already. I have to do this off stream uh, because it's going to show me a special code. Let's just go to this for a second and listen to this music while I just link my account. One sec. Uh, I have to go to the TTWL forward slash thingy, and then I put my link code in. At least they make it easy. Okay, they made it real easy for me. I linked my uh, account, so now if I enter shift codes... Oh no, I'm getting shift friend requests. Okay, am I going up in this? Yes. What's this? I saw the music on. No, no. Oh, that's a lot of codes you guys are pasting there. Where'd you get those? I'm copying them right now. Okay, I got them. Yeah, you guys, if you play this game, and if you played, like, any Borderlands game, there's these things called shift codes, and they give you keys to open, like, very special boxes in the game. And that is what I just did. Same code reported on multiple sites. Thanks, Big Glass. I entered all those. Um, wait a second, what's here? Nothing. Alright, so I want to go in this cave for some reason. Because the hoof prints said so, right? Or no, I'm going this way because I came out of the cave. And I passed this. Right? And then... When do we get to use spells? What came out of there? A health? Why would I need health? Another waystone guides your path. I haven't done anything! Going through a pack of nasty, pinchy yeah. What? I will kill them all. I'm gonna pinch him back. Oh god, here he comes! Oh, nice! Killed it! And got all of its gold. Ah, another one! Whoa! You have defeated the crabs! Luckily, they were carrying their life savings. All yours now! You shouldn't carry your life savings if you're a brittle crab on the river. They gave everyone a diamond key for BL3 in the run-up to this game's release. It's the rarest key they have. Oh, really? Oh, they're trying to... They're trying to make you want to play this one. This is very pretty so far. I, I wasn't sure if my computer would run it on Ultra, but it does. Because uh, I'm still only using a 20... Only. Uh, a 2070. Is that what I'm using? Because my... 3070... Sorry, it takes me a second to remember exactly what I have. My 3070 is still in RMA uh, Wonderland right now, getting fixed. What's going on over here? <laughs> 2060 Super. Yeah, I had a 2060 Super. Shit, what am I using? Everything Didn't it say on the... <laughs> the That's right. I think it says... 
No, it does not. Never mind. The queen has ruled the Wonderland since I was but a humble player. Can I open this now? She has foreseen your arrival and left a powerful weapon for you. The weapon of a fate maker. What is it though? I'll open it. Borderlands art style is cell shaded and that helps reduce load. Yeah, it's always looked like this, hey? Okay, open it. What do I get? A thumbs bane? Damage 16, cross bolts deal 3% increased damage for each crossbow. Okay. It's a gun! <laughs> this thing reminds me of Grammy. Hold and Weber, but still capable of shooting skulls off necks from 20 paces. <laughs> RT to Wait, shoot, LT to aim down fantasy? the sights. You're in Tainus fantasy! Alternate Weber! firing mode. Four shot burst or two shot burst. Let's go four shot burst. I only get two right, shots per thing. clip. From here, you can spy a quaint little village nestled in the bodacious bosom of the valley. It better be bodacious. I don't a see anything bosomy. Who's down there? If I was sealing away the dragon lord, it would be in an inconspicuous ruin, such as that castle right over there. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Give me all that then. Hey, Nefisto. So it taught me melee damage um, with my axe, hitting shit, and it gave me a gun to practice uh, shooting. <sighs> All right, that's a nice burst. <laughs> I shot him, why didn't he die? Get him on ambush! Go break some bones, fate maker. <laughs> I may not need four shots. I'm gonna switch back to two shot burst because these guys are really weak. Or no, they're not. Maybe I need four shot burst. I do. Come on, go get him. So the skeletons, it looks like I can just smash them. Where's my health? Oh, it's behind me. You guys can't see it. I will! Thanks, Wanda Sykes! Faithful servant of the dragon lord! Tell me where his tomb is, or I'll make you a skeleton too! Ribula? I don't know! I swear it on the queen's diamonds! I feel like it could be louder. I just wish that, um, I, I tried putting it on headphones mode, but I don't know what the most boosted one is. Hi-Fi? I have no idea what the fuck hi-fi means. Lies, you are soaked is that louder? Spread out my undead hordes. We must find the master. Open this, open this. Okay, smash that. Follow the yellow paint. Wee! <laughs> hey, a box. There better be something for my spell. What's that? A donut? A ward. Common capacity. What does it do? Ooh, you found a ward. <gasps> That's like a magical shield above your health. Damage inflicted upon you will first be removed from the ward if your ward goes down. Oh, it's a a shield, duh. That's right. There's shields in this. Shields of like every single kind. More boxes. High fidelity, yeah, but does that mean louder? <laughs> Oops, I don't think I can make it to this, can I? I can. But that did nothing because there's no reason to be up there, fuck! Whatever. There's no fall damage in these games, right? Yeah, you can you can experiment a lot with um, platforming in this. And there are a lot of parts where you have to actively platform perfectly. I'll run this way, maybe there's more enemies here? Or at least there's two boxes, but um, right now I just have to continue to the village. I keep thinking that there's going to be um, some magical key box, but there isn't. Not this early. I know I have to really... Hey, wait a minute. How the hell am I going to get past this? Uh -oh, With my spells? Bars your way to the village. We're ruined. All is lost. <laughs> Very heroic. Tina, can we blow up the rocks? Sorry. Impossible. Without explosives! Oh, there's an explosive! Perfect! Could it be in the sound section of Windows or try a different setting in the game other than headphones? Maybe only yeah. do stereo, not 5.1? Yeah, I could try stereo. If you want them to explode. Uh, if there was stereo. 
Yeah, it's not in Windows. Uh, the, I am always streaming from this computer at 100%, and I, I usually it's too loud. Usually I have to I have to turn it down on my GoXLR or the streaming software, uh, but I've never actually had to turn it up beyond that. I mean, I could just add gain if, uh, if I wanted. So it's on hi-fi. The only option is small speaker. That's got to be, uh, that, that has to be probably the loudest one that you can do. Lost hope. You hear the roar of raging fire and the clackety clackety of bones. We're here to save the village. Yeah, it's on 100%. Andy Samberg plays Valentine. Ooh, the village is already ransacked and crawling with skelly men. Ooh, skelly men. We're here to avenge the village. All right, I'm coming to kill you, skelly men. I have to ADS this constantly. I'm not very good at shooting this that far. Oh, that's a decrepit archer. I better keep grabbing ammo, though, because I am absolutely using up all my ammo. I want to go inside these buildings. Oh, you really thought you were going to win, didn't you? I'm just going to see how it sounds when I shoot. Mm, it doesn't go that loud. I'll see if I can boost it. What's that? Is that frost barrel? Ooh, a safe, a safe. I should just be getting this shit as soon as I walk by it instead of going back and looting afterwards. Let me use my magic, you cowards. How do I, I don't even know how to use it. It didn't tell me how to do it yet. 257 likes on YouTube. You guys, thank you. I feel like with all the subs and stuff we're getting today, there's a very good chance we could get to you know what. An extra powerful skeleton arises. A badass. A badass. No, not not for long. Froze him. He didn't like that. Action skill unlocked. You've just leveled up. You've now unlocked your first action skill to slot the first skill press. Uh, the select button and you can go to the skills menu check out your skill tree here as well if your skill is slotted you can use it in game by pressing rb finally you receive a skill point and a hero point every time you level up which can be spent on skill and hero point upgrades in the same skills menu it also immediately gives you a full mm, health and award and puts a small wintergreen mint on your character's mouth <gasps> Ooh, really Small wintergreen mint. Come on, new points available. That's where you spend your hard earned skill and hero points. Okay. So, first action skill you select your first skill here at level two. More skills will unlock later, and you may return to the screen to slot any unlocked skill. Okay. The second one is skill points, passive bonuses. Hero points is down there. It's okay to min max if you want. Balancing the game is Tina's problem. <laughs> I may just do that. Each class comes with a strong passive ability called a feat. These will unlock early in the plot and are active as long as the class is slotted. No points needed. Hmm. Secondary class. Where, what is it pointing to? Okay, so... Polymorph. Not equipped. The Fate Maker turns an enemy into a skeep. If they are immune, the Fate Maker instantly casts a free spell on the enemy, gaining two stacks of spell weaving. So, yeah... That is selected. So now when I press uh, RB, that turns them into a skeep, and the other one is not ready yet. Ah! Shit! Now that's loud! That's the proper sound. I was concentrating, so... <laughs> I didn't expect that. Tiny Tina donated 7777. Tiny Tina here from the Wonderlands. Cheers and salute to all. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, that was nice and loud. Steve, thank you very much. It's the game that's not loud enough. I'm going to check the, um, the, what do you call it? The mixer in Windows. Thank you, Steve. You're a get the hell off the mug. It's time for Tiny Tina Steve. Steve, thank you very much, as always, for supporting the stream like that. It's a really big deal. 
Welcome to the mug. Welcome to the mug. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, the music is gone. Okay, give me a sec, guys. Steve, thank you very kindly. Okay, listen to this for a second while I just alt-tab out of the game and hopefully it doesn't crash. And check the mixer. Let's see. Open volume mixer. Ooh, it is 100%. Oh, yeah, it's at 100%. Uh, I could boost it, but that might make it sound really bad. Okay. Yes, I just had to go look. Oh, yeah, the Book of Pi. I don't have it standing up anymore. I'll stand it up so the next time we go to that. It'll be look looking like we are having a book club here. A Pi book club. All right, so I did that. Polymorph Steve, thank you very much. Is the sound bad for you? Sounds fine to you. Oh, um, for some reason the game just sounds a little quiet. I don't know if it's just me and my headphones today. Does it sound fine? Okay. Make a cherry pie and take a pick. I don't even have any cherries. Also, I'm on a diet. It's going to be a very, very small cherry pie. <laughs> How many do I have? Skill points, one. Okay, so spell sniper, critical hit chance increased. Portion of all increases the Fate Maker receives to spell damage is also applied to her gun damage. Oh. That's really useful. Reload speeds increased. Hmm. A personal pie. Yeah, like one of those tiny ones. I could do that. Make the world's smallest pie. You don't think it's that quiet? You do prefer a quiet game sound? I don't know if it's you or not, but I like the volume. Then it's just me. I don't know. Maybe I've just been listening to music too loud. And I'm deaf now. Crit, I like this one. A portion of all increases the Fate Maker receives to spell is also applied to the gun damage. So that's pretty useful. Because if I feel like using a gun. Also, is this my only freaking spell? These are hero points, right? Oh, no, they're not. Mm, does it say I can spend on them? No, it doesn't. I'll get this. And I can't spend on these. View hero stats. Oh, good. So I get one point here. Uh, which one is crit damage, crit chance? Let's, let's, let's go, like, confirm hero stats. There we go. Carnage. Okay, she what did I get? I picked up all of this stuff. Might as well save her ass. Kama of the Butcher. Okay. That is, um, ah! That was nothing. Uh, this is just a... Hold on a second. Why is it telling? There's that thing is in front of that. That's bad. I'm gonna take it, but uh, it's a cleave. It'll just pick it up. Uh, this does more damage, so I'm gonna equip that instead of my thingy. And this stuff I don't need. That's health. Okay, he dropped two interesting weapons, but it said that. Um, oh, revive peasant ass peasant. Use your action skill. What if I? Use my action skill on the peasant. Doesn't say what happened if you do that. Okay, so if you guys are just getting here, we're playing Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. It is made by the people that make Borderlands. It's essentially, uh, it's very similar. I'm feeling the, the feel of the game is pretty much identical. It's got some smoothness, which the other ones always did too, but it's in a different setting, so. For all purposes, it's a different game. Revive ally, sure, come on. And I'm gonna use my spell on you. Thank you for saving my peasant ass stranger. <laughs> How can I ever repay you? Stand still. As much as it kills me to refuse payment, I'm afraid I'm on an urgent quest to prevent the return of the Dragon Lord. You're a fate maker. Fate maker. I knew the queen would send us a hero. The tomb is in the crypt below Castle Herofast. You must hurry before his minions find it. Mm? The tomb is inside a crypt. The perfect hiding place. <laughs> May the queen's favor see your noble quest through. Is that really Andy Samberg? <sighs> My peasant ass is killing me. Let me turn her into a thing. Thank you, thank you. 
Nothing happened. She's not an enemy. I guess that's why. Okay. Open gate. Investigate castle ruins. Have I already done that? That's behind here? Yeah, I gotta do that first. Uh, okay. Oh, and those zip lines. You can take those. Just let me go up there. You can take these down. Unless that's only for the enemy. Yeah, that's not for me. I hope it's looking good for you guys on the stream and sounding good too, okay? The ruins of Castle Harrowfast are just out yonder. Which is fantasy for saying. It's over there, baby! I sense the dragon god's <laughs> presence! Ribula. I love his name. Find him, Get him! Little skeletons! Let's see, so there's a frost barrel there. They're actually all over the place here. They're barely doing any damage to me, so I'll, I'll save the frost barrels for enemies that actually need them. Like, there could be like a berserker or an asshole coming out here. Look at this guy, decrepit warrior. He's got a shield. Not for long, you're gonna get frozen, bitch. Hey, it didn't hit him. Shit, okay. Well, now I'm just freaking getting it. Okay, I'm gonna use my attack on this next guy. Let's see. There, use it on him. Turn into a sheep! Look at him go! Then you can just shoot him when he's a sheep. That's so sad. And looks like I can use that, like, non-stop. That, that reloads really fast. Where is the last guy? Up here? No, no, it's still reloading! Oh, shit! Five seconds, four. So there's like a 15 second cooldown on turning people into a sheep. Now I have it again. You guys can see in the bottom right hand corner of the screen. But I'm wondering when do I get to actually shoot the spells out of my hands nonstop? Because that's not something you can shoot nonstop. Turn into a sheep. Come back here. Come back here. Get back here! My <laughs> Don't forget to find hidden, find hidden die. They're the only way to increase your loot rarity chances drops. I haven't seen any. Daniel Webster, thank you for following on Twitch. Hey. George Gonzalez, thank you for subscribing on YouTube as well as Colton. Thank you guys. What's going on here? Can I go in anything? You can never go inside the buildings in this. You can always go in like big areas like in here, but in ti inside tiny buildings, you never know who's actually gonna spawn in a doorway. Okay, let me check something. Social, if I go here, um, I can go to shift, no, mail. Skeleton key, three available. Two available, one available, loyalty rewards. Accept the item. Nothing popping up, but I will be able to open a skeleton box. Well, what's going on down here? Ooh, what's that scrawled upon yonder part? What is it? Poetry the page? Surely oh. Surely the author would be glad to see its safe return. Maybe. Banner color, full moon, customization, unlocks the customization in the quick change system when used from inside your inventory. Oh. Wait, an outfit? I remember there being like really silly outfits in this. When you got more than one gun, you can switch between them. Oh, what's this? Combat spicy, like jambalaya. So, <gasps> hello. Maybe after this quest, I could be the bunker master. I've been working on a campaign. It's got orcs and kissing. Ew. The UI is really weird right now. Tina, don't play no more, okay? But it's all good. He doesn't want kids. Ugh. Okay, <laughs> this is a gun actually instead of a crossbow. Damage five times two, fire rates way faster. Magazine size 32, 19, 14. This is way faster. Let's try this. I'm gonna equip that and just take that. Let's see how it does. Full auto, burst, full auto. Let's do full auto. Spray and pray, baby. When do I get to use my magic spells? Sometime. So it looks like I'm still gonna be using guns. For some reason I thought that there wouldn't be guns at all if you were a magic man. 
Oh, is this frost? Or is that electrical damage? That's frost damage! I didn't even notice! So when they're frozen, I can just go up to them and smash them. I love that gun! That is great! That's so powerful. How would they give this to me so early? I know it's it's like it's less damage than the crossbow, but the crossbow you have to get exact hits. This I can just spray all over them, freeze them, smash them. Oh, what's that? That's the die. Find all lucky dice in Snoring Valley. I get shit from it. Great axe of the butcher. That's gonna be my new melee item, I guess. And this fox glove. I'll just pick these up. Some other shit fell out of it, too. Where'd it go? Hopefully, I can still get it. I'll go there in a sec. I didn't open this. It's just money! Oh, down there, down there. I see it. Okay, I got some other come of downfalls. Really a bit faster, but I'll just pick it up. So when you find the dice, that's when you get the special... special items. You think the first drops boss drops a spell? Yeah, Charles, I got it, and it's only the turn into a sheep spell. I thought I was gonna be, like, blasting non-stop spells at them. Because it said this class is something that has to drop us. It relies on, um, constantly casting spells, right? My new axe. Hey, I mean, you're supposed to die in one hit, you bastard. This gun, it's good, but it takes forever to reload. Hella decrepit? Well, this place is super grim. I love it. Grab that spell book. Oh, finally. Do I get a spell book now? Give me this. Magic barrage, finally. Frost damage, projectiles per cast. Yes. They should be fun. My first spell, the LB. Spell Woo. You can cast the frost spell contained within. Oh, it's definitely different. Uh, wait, I cast this frost spell. Now, how do we get into the tomb crypt? It's not casting. Oh, the cooldown. There's cooldown on this too. Why would it tell me the whole deal is casting non-stop? Ready to cast. The floorboards of the throne hall seem uh, rotten and brittle. Last time. Are we going down there? Follow the chandelier. Okay. <gasps> oh shit! Slotty time. <laughs> Harrow fast. Last words of Duchess Harrow. Duchess sucks. My servants suck. And prophecies? I spit upon prophecies. <laughs> that was me spitting. Because they suck. For six generations, my family has clung to this stupid prophecy. The Harrows must guard over these lands, lest a great evil rise again. Well, guess what? These lands suck. I'm getting out of here. One last meal, and I'm moving to the capital. Hmm. <laughs> not bad, though. I... Uh, uh, <coughs> guards! You hear a rumble and a booming laugh. She got poisoned? I can fucking take him. Who is it? Oh, I can even laugh right back at you. <laughs> How'd that feel? I found it. The tooth inside the crib. The perfect hiding place. I am coming, my dark master. Maybe I should put this on burst. I'm gonna put it on burst. Let's try burst. I am a little bit more accurate on burst. It has a pretty uh, wide firing. Uh, what do you call that? When it's wide like a shotgun. It's 
not a radius. You think at some point you can replace your action skill with another spell and use two spells? Yeah, that's what I want. It, it's, I think it said that. Look at him. He's no more. Oh wait, there's more guys? Okay, hold on. Take that! And let me just open these boxes. Is it ever anything but ammo? Widespread? Yeah, I was gonna say something like that, but... I was thinking maybe there's like a better... Within your mind. A better word. It asks a question. Who are you? Who are you? I am a fight Micah. <laughs> Smartly, baby. Yeah, it is Mind spread. Oh. Mm. Enter Dragon Lord's tomb. Okay, it's down here. But do I wanna? I have to. Oh yeah. shit. <laughs> <laughs> I got a special figurine for this guy. One second. Better be good and painted. Rising before you is one of the Dragon Lord's most loyal undead soldiers. It's Ribula. Oh, it is nice. Ribula, he's skeleton mage, wielder of undead magic, and a total suck up. I'll just give all of that to you. No, he destroyed my fucking... Oh, I walked right into him and now I'm dying. I walked right into that spell and I'm almost dead now. Oh, I gotta open a box to heal. I healed, okay. I'm gonna switch to full auto for this bitch. Got him! There's still time. You can seal the dragon lord away before he escapes. I can fuck. Okay, go. Pick that shit up. Or can I do I have time? I have time. Seal Dragon Lord away. Okay, I'm gonna pick this stuff up. Let's see. Barb, let's equip that. That's cute. Melee damage. Slot scene, fully automatic, semi-auto. Yeah, but it's not a, a frost gun. Oh, a new... Yes, a new shield for sure. Taking that. And I've opened up every other box. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, seal them away. Ugh! Oh, fuck. He's back? Or what? Oh shit. Boy, Dragon Lord, come, and get it. come on, show me your health bar. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, not happening. Come on, the Fate Maker never beats the villain in the first quest. Come on. Still, you're stronger than the ones she sent before. Hmm. I wonder. What? I wonder. Oh fuck. We'll meet again, Fate Maker. But for now, I have to go pay an old shiny friend a visit. <laughs> See you around the neighborhood. <gasps> that is Will Arnett. We gotta track him down. I want that big bad boss kind of loot. Do you think Penn and Teller is gonna be in this phone again? That was that was my f finest moment. That was the best surprise in the last one that I played. Hey, the Monster Gamer 124, thank you for following on Twitch as well as I didn't drill 788 and Wolf Blue. Thank you guys. Welcome. Thank you for subscribing to my YouTube channel and follow me on Twitch. It's all really very nice of you. I appreciate it. And it's also good because you'll know when I go live. Duh. So this is a blue weapon. It does... Mm, it's a Dahlia and mine is Dahlia too, but it doesn't say that it's a frost weapon. So let's try it. I'll equip it. It's new. This is better. Uh, that is, oh, magic barrage. Okay. I should simple cast, fire and forget. So does that mean that it um, sticks? I equipped that, but where did that go? Oh, thorn of treetops, damage 23. 
That's three shot burst. Um, hmm, I'll just take it. Magic barrage of flickering. What's this? I want all of these. Guard of eager. So it has slower recharge delay, but higher because my current one is 99. It's 137. And it has a lower delay. Let's take that. Okay, what is this gun? Oh, this is just pew pew pew. But there's no reticle. Ugh. Wait, how do I change weapons? Let's go here. Uh, inventory. Check out your loot. Okay, I know how to do this, I think. Uh, banner color full moon. Okay, I don't need that. Um, what I want is I've got apparently two weapons equipped and I didn't realize. Um, green spine of the eagle and thumbsbane. Let's change thumbsbane for something fun. Thumbsbane. I don't have another blue. I only have greens. Uh, that's damage 16. Let's do damage 19. I could have put that other thing on there. How do you switch weapons again? Oops. Uh, let's see. Pain and Terror were great names. Yeah! Oh, I really like them. Right up there. No, don't touch that. Mm. I forget how to switch weapons. Oh, that's how. Okay, so I have this piece of shit on. And I have this pew pew gun. I don't love it. I'm putting the frost weapon back on. Which one was it? Which was it? It should say somewhere on it, like a, a frost symbol. Oh, there it is. Three damage per second, 7% chance. Okay, swap that with my blue gun, even though it's good. Has 10% crit. Oh, fuck. Uh. I'll switch it for the whatever. Okay, that's how you switch. I'll keep it because it has a nice firing mode. What's this? Prophecy, fire and dreams. Also, it'd be nice if that would play while I'm looking at my inventory because that stuff is often uh, just blah, 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 blah. Now, um, I'm looking for my spells that I currently have equipped. So, would it be an a journal? Skip. Inventory. Um, oh, here. Gear. Magic Barrage of Legends. And if I wanted to switch it, I only have two other ones. Magic Barrage or a Flickering. And that's 10 times 4. That's also 10 times 4. 2%, 12. I just have to choose. Do I want 50% chance of... Yes, I do. Many do. With a heart full of fire and dreams of dragons and magic. Okay, let's slide under this. Watch this. Only one way. Who's that? Despite your heroic efforts, the dragon lord has escaped! What are those? Wait a minute. Did you hear what he said? I'm gonna freeze the water. Friend? Do you think you, if I freeze the water, I can stand on it? He's he's no. I can freeze myself, though. To warn Queen Blood Stallion of the dragon lord's escape, you must travel far across the Wonderlands to the capital city Oh, I leveled up. I received a quest reward, uh, equipped a new weapon. Sure, what did I get? This, parable, damage 24, is it a shotgun? Whoa, 26 damage per second, 8% chance of crits, looks like. So I could replace that with my pew pew one. Is that a rifle? Um, yeah, maybe it is, let's see. I can't tell the difference between a rifle and a shotgun in the picture. Oh, it's one of those. All right, my new point is uh, for this. So since uh, I early game doesn't look like it's giving me enough um, spells so that I'm able to cast spells constantly. Looks like I do have to still rely on guns. So I will keep getting gun damage is 15% of spell damage or spell critical hit or reload speed. Does that mean reload speed gun? I mean, it is a picture of a one, two, three, four, five, six, like a revolver thing. So maybe that means gun, but I'll just do this one again. Why not? And then I got a hero point, so we're going to keep min-maxing mm, dexterity for crits. And just hope that uh, whatever I hit lands a crit. It's usually a good chance if you max it. And it's nice and cheap. What's this? Oh, this is like um, a launcher, not a rifle. It has a, oh, it has a shield too when you aim, ADS. 
Oh, click on the purple loot to free up space in your inventory. Do I need to yet? Inventory, purple. Click on purple loot to free up space. Um, I'm not sure what you mean by that because I don't see any purple loot. I only have that one thing. Um... Explain. Did I claim my credits in Gran Turismo 7, the new update? Uh, no, I didn't. And I have to do it before early April, don't I? I, I need those million credits to buy one single wasteful... The one at the top in my inventory? That banner thing? Okay, I'll, I'll do it again. The way cooldowns are, I don't think casting is a very quick, viable way to play. Perhaps possibly with more perks. I'm going to have to see if I can do the... Oh, you know what I have to do is probably max out cooldown. Oh, look at that, Ken. Oh, we get the... How long has it been? An hour and 52... Oh, no, I've been... We chatted a bit. Have I really been playing for that long? Welcome to the overworld. You've entered Tina's living tabletop game board filled with new areas, activities, quests, and dangerous encounters. While on your quest to defeat the Dragon Lord, it's wise to explore everywhere you can. You'll need experience and powerful gear to take on the tougher challenges ahead. You might find your path blocked along the way, but there are friends to be made in the Wonderlands who can aid you on your journey. Oh my god, look at this! <gasps> Whoa, that's... My head is huge! The one at the top, it's a cosmetic unlock. Oh, you click the... Yeah, I remember. I remember. Say the word! The magical word that always gets more viewers on YouTube is motherfucker. It, I just, it works. Whenever I say it, the view count goes up on YouTube. I don't know if it's true for this game, but certain games you say that word and it's just BAM. 20 more people join and they're like, motherfucker, where? Where? And I'm like, nowhere, I don't know. Oh, the road to Brighthoof is blocked. Guess you'll have to go through that tall grass. I don't want to go through the tall grass. I want to go past this freaking wood right here. Don't I have something that I can hit that with? Okay, I'm going to go through the tall grass, but it better not be like Pokemon tall grass. Probably will be. Oh, wait. No! Random encounter. You never know what's hiding in the tall grass. Be careful of enemies in the overworld. Touching them will start a combat encounter. Defeating random encounters will earn you XP and fantastic loot. Okay. Get him! Come here. What do I do? An actual battle? Oh, it is an actual battle. I gotta go find him. There's one. Okay, this has three shots, and they are all... Oh, it, it's a disc launcher! Oh! Get back here! This melee sucks! You should have ducked! Blocked or... I don't know. Not die! Where are the other guys? Oh, there. You can't shoot me while you're frozen. To an opportunist, every map is a treasure map. Assassin. I sure am doing a lot of meleeing for not liking melee. But I do like this uh, gun, especially without ADSing it super fast. But I like the free uh, shield here. I gotta level up my melee weapon, this sucks. Oh. I do it? I did it. Okay, what's this? <gasps> Flat Blade of the Stunner. So is that gonna be my new melee weapon? Yes, it is, so fast. I like it. Yeah, that's a slow axe. That's why it's not so good. A ward. I can always, uh, you can always sell and get rid of and trade away stuff. When you pick up crap, it's worth something. Okay, I'm gonna touch that thing, but... Is there anything here that I would want to get? Probably just regular shit. Melee it. Oh, you get a reward. This reward. Oh! Okay, wait. 
Cam of the Butcher, attack speed is faster, damage is lower. Currently my attack speed is 1.3, this is 22 damage, but this does critical damage 135. Yeah, let's equip that. That sounds good, and this is Mythopia. Um, it looks like it's also a disc launcher. It does 5x5s, five five as opposed to 24. No, it's not a disc launcher. But it is, um, I don't know what that is. There's so many things you have to get really good at quickly analyzing the numbers to know if it's something that you want. Melee is pretty man this game overall ammo. Oh really? It's um it's not usually what you're supposed to do. It's a gun focused game. Finally I can melee stuff. Okay, I will, but I wanna go back through here and melee this to get to that that dice. It's a die, but is it die, um, plural, or dice? Is dice plural? Ooh, Free. Lucky die collected. By rolling this lucky die, blah blah blah, said something. And then it just left. My head is so big! Wait, do I want that? Yeah, we gotta push this down. Unlock bottle cap shortcut in the overworld. Okay, hit it. Hey Rashad, thanks for subscribing on YouTube. This is the best. I am so glad you guys are here to play games and be friends. It's just been me in this cave with the bunbos and like a mountain of harsh mellow cereal for like ever. The bunbos? Have you been lonely? Who's this guy? What? No! You're lonely! I got friends! I got tons of friends! Look at all, look at all these hotties! This one, his name is Dimitri Hapadopoulos, and these are his cousins from out of state. <laughs> and Enter? No, not yet. I'm so glad you asked because they are also bombs. Great. Nice to meet you, Dimitri. <laughs> I remember that. Hey, hey. Knife you to meet you, normal. This guy seems a little on edge, but maybe he can point you to something keen. Okay. This shrine behind my well-protected and notably unstabbed back is for some old god that's fallen out of fashion. <laughs> I figure if we get all the pieces back together, they reward us real nice. With gold! I already found a piece myself, and I know where another one is. You get that for me, we can split the reward. I'll be here watching your back. Your defenseless, stabbable back. What the hell? If anyone comes at you from the front like a moron, just give him a slap. It's the stab of the open paw. Never know who might give you the old back you put. Use right stick to say no uh to, to a random encounter. Expect. Stun. Well, the proverbial you. <laughs> you personally. I'm sure you okay. is fine. So if I do come across a random encounter that I don't want, I can just slap them. What if I go behind them? It exalts, would reward you for restoring it to its former glory. This shrine is dedicated to Mool Ah. Mool Ah? What's this? Her coruscating majesty, Queen Bot Stallion, has long protected the Wonderlands with the sole magic she imbues into the land itself. But such a precious wall requires guarding as well. Oh, I gotta go to this. That's my actual quest. Is to go to this and castle so here. Queen founded a new walled city from which to oh, that's Meech. Oh, Hero of Brighthoof. Reach Brighthoof. Brighthoof. Reach Ruin the Melee Enemy. Okay, let's go in there. It just wants me to melee the enemy. Does it say specifically which enemy you have to melee? I wonder. I feel like I'm stuck on him now. I got a little bit stuck. Who's this guy? I love how they turn into like a five polygon enemy when you freeze them. A badass! I'll use my spells on him. And turn him into a sheep! So while they're a sheep, they can't hurt you, I guess. Let's try my regular gun on him now. Well 
Wow, they stay a polymorph creature for a while. What's that? All right, regular guns work okay. I was thinking that you really had to use um, elemental shit in this. But I think I have high... Oh, what's that? I want that. What are these? Oh man, those are like traps. I shouldn't have walked in there. I've got seven health left. I gotta go. I gotta find a chest. This is harder than I realized. This encounter specifically is actually challenging. What the fuck happened? That was encounter clear? Take your reward. So it didn't say, it said melee them, but it was an encounter with multiple enemies. Does this have fight for your life? Probably. Is that reload supposed to be salt bay? Oh my god, I saw her sprinkle. Did she, did she do the salt bay thing? Hey, what is that? Helical of the Fireman. It is a sniper rifle. I'll take it. Wait, is a sniper rifle crossbow? Oh my god. Let's shoot something. I accept. But my other gun is this piece of shit. I don't like this. Let's just change that. Even though it's a blue weapon, well, it's not that good. I want something like mm, that one. No, no, I want my, I want that one back. The salt gun. Wait, I left, but why the fuck? Where am I now? I thought I was gonna go back to the overworld. Did I press the wrong thing? Something gave me slow time there. Some encounters have multiple stages? Oh, that would be why. Wait, this counts as a shotgun? Oh, it's a badass. Turn him into a sheep. That's so cheap, I can't believe you can do that. Tonight. Compared to everyone else, you're still alive, huh? You should better grab that shrine piece. Saves me a trip. Better grab the what? The shrine piece? Ratchet! Oh, critical hit, gun damage, melee damage. And this one is uh better in every single way. Okay, never mind. That is nice. Oh, that is um really good against armor. Oh my god. Let's try it. Oh, this Ooh, thing. That's my reward. Crystal belonging to a broken shrine somewhere in the Wonderland. Oh. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it, but wait. Nothing else here for me. Yeah, let's grab it. Yoink. So this guy's totally gonna try and kill us, right? Totally. Uh, oh, we're back to the overworld. Okay. But, where'd that guy go? Oh, no, he's on the other side.
That's okay. One second. Okay, I have to report back to him now. See, I thought that was main quest, but main quest is I have to just get somewhere. I guess that was side quest. Oh no, he got stabbed with a didn't see that coming. A push pin? He stabbed himself. I don't know. She did a really good job building this whole area. But some places are made of pins and uh I saw some matchsticks. Okay, new points available. Let's spend them. I'm still gonna go with that one. I can't spend these ones yet. Why not? I forget why not. I need some other point. Hero stats. Let's go uh, strength a little bit this time. Since I am using guns, so ambihextrous is when I am level 7. And I'm only level 3 or something? I think so. Shrine pieces remaining 1. I need one more. What is this called? It just says enter. Okay. I don't know what it is, but I'm going to go in. Hey, Black Abaca. Yeah, good so far. Encounter start. Okay, it didn't say what level this is. Oh, this is tough to shoot. Oh, no, it's not. It's a disc launcher. Let's see. The skeletons do have armor. I think. Is this guy? Shambling skeleton? What the fuck is that? Oh, remember you can uh, get really good bonuses sometimes when you run and you slide and shoot at the same time? I forget what they are, but I remember they being good. Okay, this gun is a bit too slow for me, but I still like it. I think I won't ADS this gun. I'll just quick scope it. <laughs> just kidding. You don't even need to quick scope in this because it seems like the um it seems like the auto-aim does grab without you having to aim down the sights. Oh, yoink! An emote! I don't think I- I don't feel any pull of any auto-aim with this gun. An item! What do I get? Fae of the Void, okay. And Calamity of Recovery. Oh, that's a new one. I'll equip it. Did it say it gives me recovery points? I didn't take long enough. Hey, wait, use? What's this? Wait, was that in the previous ones? What do you think of this game so far? Worth it? If you like Borderlands, it's the same, exactly the same thing as every other Borderlands so far. But just in a new setting with new story. And also there's an overworld. So I'd say if you like Borderlands, then yeah, you'd like this. And I like Borderlands enough. It's not a game I play, like, constantly, but I still really appreciate the action. Get it. Pick that up. I can? Oh my god. Okay. Now 341 likes? Well... You guys, how many likes are we even going to get on YouTube today? Seems like a lot to me. A bit too many. Too many likes. Very scary, you guys. Just kidding. Not enough likes is very scary. And thank you for everyone who's following and subscribing. Following on Twitch and subscribing on YouTube. I am streaming to both, obviously, at the same time. We are going to enter a Sir Rusty... Oh, and New Zealand. I thought it said Sir Rusty Nuts. Thank you for following on Twitch. Rebuild the Shrine of Mula and gain the favor of the gods. Carlos, thank you for subscribing on YouTube. Keep liking if you want, of course, no pressure. 
Does switching from gun to melee feel smooth? Yeah, it's fine because you just have to just press in the right stick. And it, uh, it's like pew pew and then slice. Okay, we, we were bestowed upon uh, the blessing of the gods or something. It's good. Get me to a store because we have a. Uh... A shrine piece sits nearby. Oh. All hard to get. Can I not get in there? That's a different shrine. Spud58, thanks for subscribing on YouTube. Hey. You guys, we're so close. We're so close to 100,000 subs. If you haven't subscribed yet on YouTube, what's another sub? What's another YouTube sub to your account? What? You just will see me. I got in the water! You'll just see my videos and my streams whenever you want. They'll always be on your following page. I think. If YouTube is working properly that day. Hey, we're going to a castle. Hey, Atkins. When did I join Twitch? Like a million years ago. Like seven years ago. When did you join Twitch? Like a billion years ago. Seven years, five months ago. Let's go through the Queen's Gate. Whoa. Whoa, okay. Whoa. My account is not as old as yours. Whoa. That's old. Newbie. Don't worry, those jerks at the table can't hear me. It's just us down here. Hey, I know I'm the best, <laughs> That's okay, Atkins. <laughs> I still just wanted to wish you luck on the whole quest thing. Not that you need Oh, stores! Right? <laughs> I mean, you're the fate maker. I want to shop here. I know, it's not obvious. If if you're watching the stream and you're not looking at these tiny little numbers right there, like right now there's 111 on Twitch and 286 on YouTube. If you're not watching those, you're not going to know. They're so small. Can I have this? Item of the day? Pan Goblin? So, as you guys know, there is inventory management in this. I'm going to be very William Nilliam about what I sell and buy. Uh, how much does that cost? Half my money. Let's go to sell and just start selling everything, because I don't want anything. Sort by rarity? Type? Let's go always sort by rarity. And start getting rid of shit. Everything. Everything. Mark has junk. Junk. Fucking everything's junk. Except that. Why not? Uh, now how do you sell? Sell all junk? Oh no, there's pages and pages! Fuck, okay, so where- how do we sell? I can just sell quickly. Sell. Cleave- oh, that- I need to equip that. Should I sell these spells? Probably, right? Cause they, um... Uh, how do you compare? Compare? Compare. Oh no, you can only do that. Well, basically what I know is that I have everything uh, equipped that is the best. Because I only equip the best. And unfortunately this is really slow, so I, I, what I have to do is mark as junk is faster. No, fuck. It's not faster! If I press the right button, it's faster. You just have to go do 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 do. I wonder if there's any way to sell all gray. Because you have to press left stick to mark as junk. Those are equipped. Wait, what is this? Why did I make that? And that's equipped. Okay, sell all junk. Okay, that was easy. Easy enough. So now, how much money do I have? I have 7,000. Oh, that wasn't very much that I made. Ugh. So, okay. 102. Compare with my current one. Every map is a treasure map. That's, uh, whatever. I'm, I'm happy with the shield that I have. Okay, what are you selling me here? A sword? It is good. Riveter of the Engineer. Great Axe of the Butcher. Ed Eidolon? What does that mean, Eidolon? That's a sniper rifle. 
I don't think I'm gonna find anything amazing here. Oh, this one sells spells. Calamity. Okay, compare with what I got. I got Calamity of Recovery, which does slow enemies, simple cast, fire and forget, 10% less spell cooldown. That's really good. That's the best. I don't think anything can beat that, can they? There has to be, um, last for eight seconds, blah, blah, blah. No, everything out of these stores sucks. So never mind. Oh, what? I can't break those boxes? So wait, am I, do I have equipped my new sword that does that damage? No, I don't. Put that on. Oh, can't sell. Oh, that's what that means. Uh, I have to mark it as a junk or favorite. Okay, I'll mark it as don't sell. Or not. You can only just mark it as a favorite. Never mind. Ah, now when I slice people, it's going to slice their armor right up. Let's snipe them! Skellymans. Oh, only place to know Eidolon summons from Final Fantasy. Yeah, that's what that's from. In Final Fantasy IX, I think. I was like, why do I know that word? Why does it, why does it, why is it so smooth to say Eidolon? Yo, Obelix and Joseph, thank you for subscribing on YouTube. Hey. Hey and welcome. What's going on over there? All these low poly people running? Or no, are they... They're just very weird looking. Okay, look at that. That's teasing me right there. I have to remember to get that. Skeleton archer. Hey. Where are you going? I'm not sure if I can quick scope. I can. <laughs> okay. Let's go down there. Smooth, like my Twitch username. Vlakabaka, so fucking smooth. Unloading evil cargo of skelly men's and skelly women's. What? The skellies. Oh, there's so many fucking boxes here. Why are you giving me so many boxes? I need money to buy stuff from the store. Oh, look, another one of these. Find all lucky what dice in Queen's Gate. Okay, I'm in Queen's Gate right now. Ah! Where'd you come from, bastards? Oh, this is such a nice, fast uh, sword that I got. They really did a good job with lighting in this. That's um, something I'm noticing that looks different than previous ones. The lighting is really rich. Take that, skeleton mage! Whoa, what did I just cast on him? Holy shit, I casted something crazy. That was awesome. What was it, though? I equipped a spell that I didn't even read. Wait, I'm using poison damage, not acid damage? Oh. Wait, why should I use poison on skeletons? They have no flesh to be poisoned with. Whoa, what the fuck? What is that? farther if I were you, but hey, see what happens. Who was that? Remember, style before stats every time. Where did that come from? Was that that guy? That's a sniper. I can snipe him back. Shit. What the hell was that? Wounded skeleton sniper? Oh my god. Okay, you have to not, uh... Not fuck around too much and not really pay attention, because this game is harder than it seems. <laughs> sometimes. Especially when they fucking just jump on you like that. That guy came out of nowhere. I don't even know who he was. Ah. 
Is the rifle Jacob's brand? It probably is, because it shoots like one. <laughs> I miss my frozen gun. Whoa! Badass skeleton knight! Okay, I have to use my special spell on him. Extinction event! Extinction event? That is such a good attack! Where's my health? Yeah, the sniper rifle is really hard to use because my sensitivity is so high. Magic barrage. Uh, that's a poison one. But I really like the barrage that I have right now. It's like a freaking meteor that falls down on their heads. Okay, let's switch something. Um, I'm not a huge fan of my sniper rifle anymore. It's good, but it's, uh, oh, it is black powder, not Jacob's. And I sold everything else except for my favorite, uh, parable. So let's put that one back on. Is that also a disc launcher? Fuck, I only have two disc launchers right now. Whatever. Thanks, pretty vacant. Can you get a grenade launcher? Yeah, definitely. There is every single gun you could ever think of in these games. Where's the health, though? I really got to heal. That's ammo in the bone pile. Maybe there's health in here? Oh, there's a fancy box here. There's going to be something good. Yeah, open it. You got to look for these. This is a fancy chest, I think. Or no, it says basic. Hemlock. Calamity. Next level up, I cannot forget. I have to get uh, something that slows down um, my cooldown, or speeds up my cooldown. Different elements are stronger on different enemy health bars. Gray bar is ice, yellow is poison, red bar fire. Right! Is it... I remember there being armor and health and shield in the previous ones. Uh, Paladin Mike, who's that? He's coming to help me? Okay, one sec, Oi! Paladin Mike. You citizen! Over here! Nothing else? Just these two safes? Okay. So wait a minute, maybe it is like the other ones where you had to use electricity on blue shields. That could be, uh, Daniel Webster, what, uh, I saw you what I remember. On the beach. Is it actually that different in this? Hey, Manny. Olven Diaz, I'm using 100 what FOV. Like I've got time for it started off on 90. I'm up to my cod piece and I'm dead! I came out of nowhere! Yeah, that's the Dragon Lord's doing. Just came from robbing his tomb, actually. <laughs> the Dragon Lord? Bollocks, we'll have to deal with him later. <laughs> right now, we have to break this siege. Okay. The undead have catapults lobbing skeletons over the walls. I need you to destroy them. Here, take this C4. Okay. Tina, I know you like explosives, but can you make it more fantasy thing than C4? <laughs> right, 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 right. Oh, it is the same. Okay. What's the fantasy C4? Uh, uh, yeah, right. Uh, here, take this uh, fantasy <laughs> Fantasy four, fine. Uh, er, ye, ye old kaboom. Okay. I'll help the villagers get to safety. Fight through the 
siege fields and use that fantasy for to blow the catapults to kingdom bloody come. <laughs> Okay, I'll go do that, but hold on. I got two disc launchers. They're not disc launchers. What the fuck are they called? Uh, they're Hyperius guns, but, um, which one do I like better? That does 23 damage, does 24. I do prefer the that one. So I want to switch for something a little more basic. Like, uh, what's this? Stovepipe of Discipline. That is a... Wait, is it a shotgun? Well, why do they fire a disc? They're shotguns. So this shotgun should work like an actual shotgun. Plus 32% gun damage. That sounds like it's not being accounted for in the damage. That sounds really high. This is low accuracy, but no type. Oh, I'm gonna try this. Ooh, okay. Well, let's just see. Buttsville? There. Is ahead. This is where Buttspot lives. I need some fucking help. I really miss this part. Been too oh, I see. I After a few centuries, oh, it's only a single shot. That's why. So I got to get a few of them in the in the shot here. Could be faster. Plus thirty two percent gun damage though. Take that zombie gunner. <laughs> I guess I'm just saving my uh, spell shots for like badasses and stuff because the, the cooldown sucks so bad. Magic barrage of worrying. Who's using fire on me? One of these boxes has health, surely? A little bit there. Okay, who the fuck is doing that? Skeleton mage? Oh, okay, you're getting it. Whoa, something launched me. Who's that? Skeleton mage again? I thought you were dead. I used like a whole spell on him. Ooh, fancy box. Or common box, as it's called. I'll just pick everything up. Kettle drum of discipline. That is a different kind of gun, which looks good. Let's try it. Oh, it's a double uh, thing. Double hole. What do you call that? The shotgun has a double barrel. Level up! Fuck! Okay, we're gonna get the thing that helps us with the cooldowns. Only I could miss a shotgun shot up close like that. Is that gonna blow? At least the skeletons blow up like they're nothing. Oh, what the fuck is that? Rock troll? Oh shit, that's who's throwing shit at me. Turn into a thing. Okay, okay, how do I do it? Slap it onto the catapult. Oh, here, place. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna go over here. Wait, what's this item they dropped? Blue? A blue bulwark. It's a much better shield, put that on. Okay, shoot it. <laughs> a double hole shotgun, is that fucking funny to you guys? You find that funny? <laughs> you know what I mean. I met this cool nerdy barista on the Echo Net, and they said I could use their B and B character if I wanted. And mm -hmm. I was like, hell yeah! And they were like, chuffed, governor. And I was like, ooh, I'm stealing that accent too. Chuffed, governor. Okay, <laughs> let's spend our points. I got uh, one of each. Why can't I spend these yet? I don't remember what it said about this. I want these. Two more points in tree to unlock. Like, total tree? Like, I gotta put these ones? S uh, reload speed. 
Oh, very soon I can get these. Yeah, I see the bar moving it behind it. Okay. So what's the spell cooldown? This one. Intelligence. When am I going to get to open a skeleton box? Any health there? So when you pick up the gold bars, they're worth like 28? I want like a million. What is a gold bar actually worth? What's this? Vestments of toughness. Or Vetma. Um, did it put them on? Five per row. Yeah, it makes sense. Now it does. King Cap, thanks for subscribing on YouTube. Hey. Welcome. What's this? Sigil. I'm gonna sell all of this stuff. Okay, so I destroyed a catapult. I don't know if that's all the catapults, if there was only just one. I see way down there. Nothing. Hey, remember at the beginning of the level, I saw two dice and I couldn't get to the first one because it was across a bridge. Maybe we're going to get to it later. Or it's something like behind here that I... Oh shit, there is another catapult. Fuck. Take this, skeleton bitch. Relentless! Why are you relentless? He's just extra special. I should have tried maybe one of those other guns that I got. This reload speed sucks. Is there a gun in there? No. Luckily, when I pause, the whole game pauses, hopefully. So, Kettle Drum of Discipline, how about no? Let's try that other gun I didn't want to sell. Oh, it's only 16, 18. This one is this one, Hemlock. Let's go back to this bitch. At least I can rapid fire that. Oh, it's in full auto right now. Never mind, I don't have to use semi auto. Take this, you skeleton made bastard. I'm not going to ADS this. I have a poison! Oh! Ah, I'm almost dead! Fucking run! Run and hide! I have to get some health! There's got to be a health in a box here somewhere. I already opened these. No, there's no health in here. Well, at least my shield recovers in like eight seconds. That's good. But surely I should increase my health bar. Hmm, nothing there. No health there. How about here? Nope. I'm gonna be all healed by the time I fucking open every single box. The advantage of playing solo game pause when looking at inventory? Thank God for that. What'd you drop? Best men's of toughness! Ah, my fucking shield's down! Come on, shield recharge, you bastard! <laughs> if I, this would be a lot easier if I was playing with that mouse and keyboard, but this is not really a mouse and keyboard game for me. This has always been a controller game. Because I guess I've always played it on Xbox. Have I? Feels like it. Come on, blow up on him. There's one more enemy left, and it's the rock troll who's throwing fucking rocks at me. I'm gonna use a spell on him, but I'm looking to see if there's anything magical or secret. Hey, where'd you come from? The ground? Bitch. That's not who I'm interested in right now. I'm interested in this rock troll. It's so easy when you just turn them polymorph into a little sheep. 
that you can shoot. The sheep is so fucking harmless, although it has a shitload of health. Who's shooting me from over there? Okay. Placing the C4. And a plate of chitin. Are these crafting materials? I don't remember what the hell these are. You have a higher chance of better loot and co-op though. Yeah, but you have to share it. And I'm doing just fine with my basic bitch loot. I'm happy with it. Co-op is fun sometimes, but it's incredibly, incredibly distracting for me while streaming, I realize. And I've realized it's so late in my streaming. But uh, although I've had fun in all the times I did play co-op with you guys, it's uh, very hard to stream. You didn't share it in three with the menu option. Oh, that's true, I didn't. When you have something polymorph, your crits will cast your spell, ignoring the cooldown. <gasps> no! What if we undestroyed that last Is that why it keeps casting the spell over and over again? No touching the miniatures. But launching yourself with a catapult sounds cool, so I'm gonna let it go this once. Hmm. Use catapult to cross ravine. I will. But first I have to run down here. Oh, that's what I that's where it is. Here it is. Remember? Remember? I remembered it. Oh, they're shooting me! Hey, why didn't the fucking spell go on this guy? I'm almost dead! I got a 12 left! Fuck! <gasps> Save your soul! Oh shit! I gotta kill him. I'm in the fight for your life mode. Reload, bitch! There you go. I died almost! Did somebody drop a bunch of purples or something down here? No, I was just seeing their bullets. I still think this shotgun is truly the best, even though it... It's not supposed to go this far, but it goes so far. <laughs> What's that? Oh, money, okay. Sinon, uh, 655 Junior, and King Cap. Thank you guys for following on, or subscribing on YouTube. Hey. Hello. Lucky dice. Hey, you're so Did anything fall down there? Single Jack. Hey, that looks like a... Maybe a good gun. Try it. Clawbringer's Plate of the Combusting Flyers. It, what is it? Uncommon. Clawbringer power. What exactly am I, oh, gear, here we go. Vestments of toughness, oh, okay. I see. So I only just unlocked that, let's see. What else do I have? Maximum health, maximum health. Ability critical hit chance, that's abilities only. Maximum ward capacity. Oh, that's your shield capacity. Um, hmm. Well, I go through shield faster than I go through health, so let's do that. Although this is a new one. Clawbringer power? I'm not using Clawbringer. Oh, I'm using something else. This is a, for a different class. But area damage, maximum ward capacity. What's area damage? Oh, that's only if you're slamming your hammer down. And this, Guard of Grace, mm, wait, that had a 26 recharge rate as opposed to my 19. That might have been better. Because I have a very large capacity um, in my shield. What's this? Elemental Blast. Oh, interesting. What is this? Lower damage, but it has a 12.6 cooldown and it restores health via damage. Oh, that's a, like a Necromancer cast. I need that. Oh, I wish I had two. I'm gonna equip that. I wish that I had two slots now for my spells. I will very soon at level seven. I'm only at level five. It's missing the blood and gore of Borderlands games though. Wait, yeah, there's no blood. Where is it? Tiny Tina is not so innocent. She doesn't 
She does like blood and gore. She plays with explosives as her friends. Okay, I'm in the catapult. Now what? Do I have to shoot that? Oh! <laughs> Honors Tower. Those catapults take hundreds of goblin hours to construct. I'm out here creating jobs, you know. <laughs> Sorry, that was supposed to be a warning shot. Okay, I want to try uh, my new spell. Let's see. I didn't need any health at that point, so I didn't get to see how, how much health it actually restored. That's kind of like something you do after your shield gets broken, just like right now. My shield just got broken, so I'm going to cast it again. And see how much it heals. Basically fucking nothing. It healed nothing. It healed fucking nothing. What? It healed 17 health and like... Oh, that's bad. I'm changing that spell. It was worth a shot. I will try other restore health via damage... things. But not that one. Now what's the one that I was using? It was like a... a giant... ball that comes down. Oh no, what was it called? Um... I'll just choose the one that does the most damage. Oh fuck, they all do the most damage. 18%, this one. But the cooldown's 22. Oh, it's all 22. I haven't tried these. Highly effective. Three projectiles per cast? Um. What's 113 versus 11 times 4? Never mind, that's 44. Uh, let's do this one. This one. Oh, I gotta save my soul. I'll just shoot that barrel. I already. Death save. Get up there. Let's try it on this guy. Oh, that's the one. The explosion. Perfect. A calisthenics ball. A medicine ball. It's like that, yeah. Very heavy, hurts to get hit in the head with one. Both of those things really would suck. Take that, skeleton. I'm so regretting my gun choices. Ooh, what'd I get? Oh, just money there. I need more! Thank you guys so much for all the follows and subscribes. I really appreciate them, okay? I see them. I'm thanking them. Oop. Most of them. Are we gun hoarding? Because I'm okay with that. Uh, yeah, we're doing something like that. I'm selling a bunch of them that are crap and then ones that I just don't understand. And now I'm standing in the fire. So I was just using this sling, single jack. Can I change it for anything that's not that? I have been holding off on using this hemlock. Oh, wait, that's nightshade. That is a frost. Two times four, that's eight. Well, that's the same. I do like my elemental damage. Oh, this one! This one's back! Oh, that's what that is. Oh, duh. This was a good gun! Now, do you guys remember there being actual music in this- in Borderlands before? I don't remember there being music, but there's like a little bit in this one. It's nice. Shield, heal up. 
Oh, there's a badass over there. Fuck. Hey, Crustacean. Oh, I have to fight for my life. Don't shoot him. Oh, no. Gotta shoot a different guy who's way easier to kill. Get him! Wow! Oh no, he's back! Let the magic begin. Okay, my badass is gone. I cannot wait to fucking cast two different spells, except for this, uh... I like the sheep one, it's pretty funny, but I just... I want to be casting fireballs constantly. Constantly. Out of ammo. <laughs> Your real family? Here? That's so sweet. What's that purple thing and who the fuck was shooting me? Oh, this bastard. Zombie gunner. No thanks. Okay, now I need to go look at all the stuff that everyone dropped. What did you drop here? Stabomancer? No, that's not me. Calamity. That's the same one. Oh, that's better though, right? I think it's Calamity that I have on right now. No, Calamity of Flickering. Mmm. So is that the same thing? Probably. Calamity sounds like a ball falling from the sky. That would be terrible. PS5? No, I'm playing on PC. Sigil of recovery. No. What's that purple there? Under armor pattern. Ooh, box. <gasps> What's that? Aegis of deflection. Oh, finally, a new shield. Minus 25% ward recharge delay. Good. So the recharge delay. Three seconds? Oh, wow. Stovepipe of discipline. That's another shoddy. Hmm. It looks good, but I don't know. If, wait, what was the reload speed on that stovepipe? Of discipline. Reload rate two, a uh, reload time 2.7. Reload time 2.1 on that one. Reload time 1.9. Okay, I knew that was unusually fast for a shotgun. This one might be still good, though. What's this? What's so good about this? Ward recharge delay? I, I know it's giving me all shotguns now, and I'm not wanting them. Games, stop! I don't just use SMGs and shotguns. I want some actual, like, really good guns. Purple, let's go. I love purple. <laughs> You always wanted combat to look like this in Fallout 4. Oh my god, that would be hectic as hell. No, no Fallout's done like that, is it? Played them all. Fallout 76, maybe. I haven't played that enough to know. Let's change it. Let's try the stovepipe. Of discipline. Hey! Every shotgun looks like this? Is Fallout 76 still a thing? Gosh, I would love to know. Flat blade of the stunner. The only thing this does better is the amount of damage. Which is cool, but it is swift. And it says melee damage, attack speed, eh, whatever. Stop tricking me, game. Sorted out those pesky catapults. That explosive glitter stuff did quite the number on them. That'll bloody learn them! Oh, regroup by the main gate. I can see him gathering for an assault. Okay, fine. Oh, good for you. See, while you're having your little heroic tantrum out there, my forces are already in the city getting ready to burn the place to the ground. Oh, this is great. We're all having fun. <laughs> There's supposed to be like 10 of those magic dice in this level. And I've only found two, I think. Do I jump down here? What the hell? Oh. Here's a nice bridge for you. 
that bridge to pop up. <laughs> Bloody infrastructure, Edip, finally came through. Hallet and Mike. Hey. I'll talk to him in a moment. One of the Queen's waystones. No way. I've never actually seen one of these before. What am I supposed to do with it? Is this an autosave point? Yes, I am. Oops. And I'm willing to sell you my autograph. Alright! I'm bloody impressed. I've only heard about those in stories. The Queen's magic has unlocked more of your power as a fate maker. <laughs> the Dragon Lord's armies don't stand a chance. Oh, class feat unlocked. Even long as your class feat is a powerful, always on passive ability that comes with the class. No points need to be spent to purchase it. Each class skill tree can potentially be built around a feat. Each class only has one feat. For more info, open up the skill menu and read all the cool stuff. Mm, okay, oh, what is it? So well. What's my feat? Not F E E T. Uh, wait, skills? Where's the feet? It said you can build around a feat, but why would you... Spell weaving. Oh. Casting a spell or reloading grants the fate maker a stack of spell weaving. Oh, I already knew about this one. Increasing the spell damage. So, right now it does plus 10% duration and cast chance. Repeating cast chance 25%. Oh, so you have to actually pay attention to that. You have to pay attention to... Your cooldowns in this. I remember attack. having to do that a bunch. This holds. How many shots does this hold? Oh my god, without reloading? 72? Look at them go. I'm helping from up here. This shotgun, although it sucks in a way, actually, uh, it's pretty good. It doesn't suck in a way. What's this shit? Leather. Boneheads incoming. Defend gates? What, these gates? Oh shit. Oh no. Castle defense? They're coming at us too fast! Oh, I got hit by a rock troll rock. Ugh. I gotta cast my big ass spell on that rock troll. I'm supposed to be able to strafe away from you, you bastard. Stop fucking hitting me with that rock! Okay, so they're more interested in attacking me than they are attacking this fucking wall. I think. It sucks, but it's good. I'll try it again. Take that, take that! Sprinkle that salt. Level up to six. No, skeleton mage, you're taking this spell. Whoa, did that one hit him? Nice. The cooldown doesn't suck as bad. It's pretty good. Turn this bitch into a shape. It wanes. There's one last guy. What? You have a sniper scope? You haven't even seen me try. Over here, fate maker. Okay, I gotta spend a skill point. Is it over here? Okay, we defended the wall right here. Good job. 
I didn't go up the stairs, though. Is that a Gatling gun on top of the wall you can use? Oh, if that is, I'll be really upset with myself. I'll check. One sec, gotta open these boxes first. Hey, Kurt Sim. Ah, uh, damn it, what are those? Damn it! Oh, why didn't I know? I could have just been doing this. Did it say and I was just not listening and just staring into space? Because that's freaking crazy. Xavier, thank you for subscribing on uh, YouTube as well as Young Soldier. Hey. Cannons. Damn cannons. Okay, wait, let's spend. I just have to put uh, one point in here. And I'm doing this one, reload speed. Oh, we can finally get that next time. Unless... No, not yet. Now I want spell cooldown, I think. Yeah, intelligence. Honestly, I didn't quite believe it. But you fight like something out of a legend. <laughs> oh, you are a fate maker. Oh. Come on, we stopped their ground assault, but there's some undead that made it into the city. No. Uh, better hurry if you're gonna stop me and save the world. I can only drag my feet destroying Bright Hoof for so long. Hmm. Whoa, what's that? Bloody gates are closed. Give me a moment, I'll get us in. It's a siege machine. Oi! Lord Sky! Oh, what's this? Open up the gates! Oh, I got a poetry page. Oh, dusk talon skies are a beauty. And Ruka, shoot, not now. <laughs> not now, Ruka. I'm busy. Ah! Where I came from? Just talk to the poet in the Bright Hoof Tavern. Hey, Ruka, can you stay here actually for me? I've got to go to the washroom. And Ruka can entertain you guys while I'm gone. Ruka, oh, be careful. Be careful, clumsy Ru. Be careful. Do you want me to get your paper bag and everyone can show you how good you are at getting in a paper bag? <laughs> oh, he's so cute. Um, check out Ghostwire Tokyo. And PC and Quantum Break. I haven't played. Wait, Quantum Break? I haven't tried Deathloop yet. No, that Deathloop's actually on like 50% off right now. Yo, thank you, Steve, for the Leon Dance 500 Elixir on Trovo. Everyone say hi to Ruka. Little Roo Roo, yeah, you're so cuddly. He gets in his little paper bag and he wants to go shopping, so I pick up the paper bag by the handles and take him around the apartment and just show him stuff. And I sing his shopping with Ruka song, and he loves it, and it's his best time of his life, is going shopping in a paper bag. Just pretend. I just show him everything around and ask him if he wants to buy it. Of course he doesn't want to buy anything, he's cheap. So you guys, please stay here for me and uh, watch Ruka. I'll put some music on. Oh yeah. Let me just make sure that uh, that is... Okay, it is. Oh, no, I'm not singing it. Oh, I don't think so. Ah! I'll hail the paper bag! Thank you for the 666! I'll hail the paper bag. Thank you for supporting the stream and Ruka. I'll be right back in a minute, okay? Maybe two minutes. Oh, will my wonders never cease? Probably not.
How perfect is this little high-fiving baby cat? He's so perfect! We could do a high-five again. High-five. Now down low. Good job. Now shake my hand. Shake. Shake a paw. Ruka, shake a paw. Not that. High five, but shake a paw. There you go. Good boy. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Ruka. Now, come on. Ah, uh, there. Okay, I'm back. Hello, welcome back. Steve, don't need elixirs in Trovo? I think I saw it right before I got up. Yeah, I did. Okay, I'm back, and I brought, um, of course, a small Ruka is here, which he should be going to put lay in his bed because he's very warm, and I am very warm, and he's gonna make me super sweaty if I have a little furry animal. And I brought, I brought a mixture of, um, I'm, I just was trying to make up a drink on the fly. I have no idea what I'm doing, but I have all sorts of different kinds of alcohol. Um, so I mixed peach schnapps with gin. Um, and I'm going to mix it with my carbonated water. So I have no idea. I mean, it smells good. I'll just taste it just, just like plain. That's peachy, actually. Wow. That is super peachy. So I will create the combination in my cup right here. Just making sure that there is no cat hair among us. We have two shots of gin, one shot of peach. I don't even know if it's schnapps. It's just peach liqueur or something. And then the rest of my carbonated water Maybe not enough to make it uh, the right flavor. Mmm. Actually, that's very good. Mmm. I don't know what that's called. Gin and peach. Delicious. A Canadian classic. Okay. I'm ready to continue. I started so late today, you guys, uh, so it's not going to be a long stream like like normal. Just a, a slightly shorter stream. So I got to turn the music down and turn that back up. Okay, what did I do? I picked up a thing, a poem, and I was looking at. Oh yeah, um, now I should do some inventory maintenance, I guess. Fuck. Okay, fine. Sell, and we're gonna sell everything gray just to make it easy. 
Is that easy? I don't need it. I don't need it. And that spell sucked. What was this one again? Sigil. Sell that. And how do you sell again? Sell all junk. I have that equipped, even though it's a gray. You thought Ruko was going to take over the game for you, but he didn't. He's, uh, he's not very good at these games. That's a sniper. Maybe I should just keep one of each. Wait, is that actually... No, that's a shotgun. Is that a, that's a shotgun, but the picture of it looks, like, different. That's a shotgun for sure, but what the hell is this? It looks like a shotgun in the picture, but it's, a. Uh, it's the other type of gun. I'll get rid of these. Clawbringer for sure. I'll keep Hemlock. Stabomancer, bye bye. Sigil of Recovery. I don't like these sigil ones. Magic Barrage, I don't care for that either. That's Clawbringer. Cala I, I love the Calamity the most. There's two Calamity of Recovering and Flickering. Get rid of this one. Guard. Oh, that's a shield? Calamity. That's a plain Calamity. I already have a magic barrage. I'll get rid of all the shields that I'm not interested in. The shield should be... Oh, that's a good one. Okay. So now I have 11,000 gold. Ruka's excellent at video games. He's very literate. He's awesome with the high fives and all. So cool. He's really good at uh, high five. Not so good at low five. He's okay at shake a paw. But it's kind of... You have to do a high five and it turns into a shake a paw. What are you trying to sell me? Devouring Hydra of Recovery. What is that? That's so expensive. Sigil, Sunder Sigil. What the fuck is that? Summons a Hydra companion that will spawn another Hydra whenever an enemy damaged by it is killed. Has a small chance to spawn an additional Hydra when damaging a boss. It only lasts for six seconds though, so within six seconds you have to kill... Oh, whenever an enemy damaged by it is killed, so you have to shoot whatever the Hydra is shooting. Uh, I'm gonna buy that! That's expensive, but... Why not? I mean, that's what, what is, that's what the money is for in this, is to buy shit and try it. That sounds freaking cool, though. So I'll take Calamity off and put on Devouring Hydra. Let's see what we can do with it. Since you outgrow items so fast, it's best to save gold to increase your backpack and max ammo. Oh yeah, right. I was wondering what the fuck I was saving money for. That would be it. But luckily I have a bunch of the skeleton keys now, so I can buy, or I can find really fancy stuff, and if it's not if my style, I can sell it for lots. This total carnage. Homes are on fire. Scary men are eating people's feet. Oh, I'm finally at Bright Hoof. This is soups to fresh. Come on. We have to clear the city. We'll make our stand in the main square. Okay. Yes, yes. Push on, my armies of unyielding darkness. Once All right, lots are appearing, so I'm going to summon the hydras. Where are they? Okay, it's shooting that one. Oh, they're so tiny. No, the hydra died. I want you to hate me. I'm talking true loaded, like an absolute I think the hydras died. Okay, so, oh, man, you have to, like, fire them into, like, a big group. I do it again, Hydra. Oh, it's so hard to see what the fuck the Hydra is shooting. Wait, what the fuck is that? Wyvern bomber? Oh my god. Turn that into a sheep. I'm not dealing with that right now. Back in business. Oh no, it's back! Okay, it only has full regular health now. Frozen solid? What? That looks way bigger than it actually was. Okay, I'll put the Hydra right there and see. It's gonna shoot. 
He's shooting that guy. Okay, so he's damaging. He's died. Did another Hydra spawn? I got ripped off! Hydra again. It's just like shooting pigeons. I mean, clay pigeons. Spell, yeah. Come on, sprinkle a little bit of salt there. These bastards. Oh, my friend is not helping very much. cannon yeah where is the cannon is there a cannon somewhere that I didn't see reach main square oh my god everything is horse themed It was a DLC from 2 that they made into a standalone, which you probably mistook it for. Oh, the um, the game being on PS Plus? Yeah, the older one for sure is. What was that one called? Who shot me? Attack on Dragon Keep. I wish I had like a sixth sense for where the best chests are. I guess if I go up high or something, let's just see. I would hide one up here. Who knows that? But that's not anything. Hmm, nothing. Just the normal ammo shit everywhere. And a tiny lockbox. It should be a one hit shotgun up close like that. Oh shit. What the fuck is it doing? I cast a Hydra at it. Those are really annoying because of how fucking high they are in the sky. Whoa, I just got almost one hit by something. And I did get one hit by it. What was it? There's a badass over there, that's why. Oh my god, Pellet and Mike woke me up. Come on, Hydras, go. It's an archer, that's why it really fucks you up badly. I just gotta heal behind here for a moment. Maybe there's some health in these boxes. Mm, maybe, maybe over here. That's a badass. I gotta turn him into a sheep. That's it. You're going in time out. Oh, I spawned the Hydra in the air. Oh my god. And two of them, three of them appeared. Look, more keep appearing. So that did work properly. And he dropped a bunch of garbage. Do I have to... Do you have a green elemental to attack the yellow bar? I do, uh, but not equipped, I don't think. Yeah, I'm only my melee weapon, unfortunately. 
What do you think? I think it's obvious. We seduce the drawbridge. <laughs> no, I'm not seducing the drawbridge. <gasps> Reach main square, seduce drawbridge. Fuck. Fine, in a moment. I will, in a second, fine. I just thought maybe there was gonna be something up here. Oh my god, what are we gonna even say to the drawbridge? Oh, I just shot it. Oh, I'm not saying nothing to the <laughs> Playing hard to get. Is it working? Yeah, I'm not even gonna make you roll for that. The Ooh. drawbridge, it digs you flavor, baby. I forgot that I put that Once in my cup. Every time. Whew. Oh no, there's more! The skeleton who brings me the queen's diamond head gets one of those novelty turkey drumsticks. <laughs> if you can't eat it, they'll club a human like a fence post. It's kind of pointless to be using the green against the enemies that let you actually walk up to them. Okay. If I could hit those wyverns or whatever they are with it, I totally would. Clear the square. This is where we make our stand. Shit. Okay. I'm gonna clear the square, but why is there not anything like uh I'm gonna put my little Drake there. No more Drake spawned. See, these wyverns really got uh, a lot of damage on them. I wonder what my companion is using. Like, I am getting all crits on it. It definitely hates this gun. Let's do another Drake there. Come on, spawn another Drake! No, another one didn't spawn, bastards. Main square, yeah, we're here, but fucking we need to kill everyone. <gasps> Look at the rainbow! That's so nice! Oh shit, they're all coming from there. Oh fuck. Can I turn the badass into into the flying sheep? Oh no, there's a skeleton archer badass too. Shit. I gotta focus him. Oh shit, he woke up! Ah! I'm getting the fuck out of here. While I heal. Oh, he's almost dead, fuck! I'm out of ammo. How did you get so much fucking health back? Got him. I'm not sure the Hydra one is for me. I mean, it's it's good if you make it work, especially with badasses and bosses. As the last lifeless skeleton clatters to the cobblestones. Spell shot power. You've done it. The I'm putting that one on. Has been defeated. Spectral talons restores health via damage. Okay, I'm going to try this one. It feels so good to be a hero. I really want these ones to work. I gave it a shot playing by the rules. Now I'm gonna have to start breaking them. <laughs> okay, I want to heal up a little bit somewhere before going to that read prophecy thing. 
There's gotta be a little health in here, or at least an enemy, because then I could try out that spell I just got. Is this a box? What is this? Maybe I don't have access to that yet. That might be the skeleton key box. Okay, let's go read the prophecy. Found again. Here, Bright Hoof seems to be telling my story. The Fate Maker wields great power in the face of evil. It feels like something lost long ago has been found again. It feels like home. <sighs> Bloody brilliantly done. <sighs> Over here, Fate Maker. I want to go to the Rainbow Palace. You saved us all, Fate Maker. You are the hero of Brighthoof! Mm hmm. What did I get? Now, about this bloody Dragon Lord business. I'm sure the Queen will be eager to meet our new Fate Maker in person. Uh, the castle gates are right over there. Look at me meeting a Queen! <laughs> we get to meet a the Queen. Gates of Her Majesty's castle swing open as though they anticipated your arrival. And then you hear the clock of perfect hooves upon the cobblestones. They belong to the most goodest, majesticest ruler ever seen by mortal eyes! Finally! Queen Butt Stallion! <laughs> no one goes to the Rainbow Palace! Her magnificence. It just washes over you, man. Yes. I feel it. It's busy. I do have a cat hair in my drink. Spilled your soda. Yes, I did, and it was in honor of the queen. Huh? Approach Butt Stallion. Where? Oh, God! Hold on, Butt Stallion. I just have to make sure that I don't have Ruka's cat hair in my drink, because I hate that. Oh, yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll tell him. Yeah, okay. So, um, she says you are the bravest fate maker oh. the Wonderlands has seen in general. It talks to me. But though you have pushed back the Dragon Lord's attack... Thank you for the 500 elixir and trovity sangwa. Oh no! I was getting to that! Yeah, it's a sort of souls. Although, thank you, Valentine, for paying attention to the exposition. The sword of souls is the coolest weapon in the whole game. Are we really getting that? <laughs> I mean, if you complete the quest, yeah. I'll murder this whole quest and everyone in it. <laughs> I'll get that sword. Fine, we'll follow by Stallion. It's in the right spirit. Mostly. Go, but Stallion. Lizzie Fizzies? Ooh. What's that? What's in here? You think Butt Stallion could speak? Her Majesty says that the Sword of Souls is hidden in the Shatter Grave Barrow. She will be reaching there personally for you. Would you say we're being bestowed a huge honor? I've always wanted to be bestowed something. <laughs> Girl, you totally just got bestowed. <laughs> I dream. It's happening. Oh, are you guys putting food orders in YouTube right now? Oh. Um, hmm, you want a burrito, you want a pizza. You want a sandwich, broccoli, ice cream, tuna sandwich. Ugh. What do you guys want to eat? Have a hamburger with a donut as a roll? Uh, you know what I want is um Remember, some kind of delicious prepared dinner like something I don't know something semi gourmet and vegetarian eggplant parmesan hmm maybe I do love eggplant I'm wanting something like I can hear sparkling it says go to Shattergrave Barrow, but I don't wanna! There's like stuff over here to look at. Oh no, it's beyond this. There's shit behind there. Fine, I guess I have to. Seems I'm not quite up to snuff yet. Already known. Oh, okay, I'm gonna mark it as junk then. Did I get 
Uh, anything for spell shot? I did. It says, wow, you did it. You want mozzarella sticks in the oven? Ooh. You want blood? <laughs> That's not vegetarian. Queso fresco enchiladas with green sauce. Mmm. You just ate some cereal? You ate checkers earlier? You want veal chicken cutlets? Wait, what's veal chicken? Do I not have this equipped? Damage dealt is increased by 20% against skeletons and zombies. I need that. Put that on. Currently, I just have spell shot power plus eight. Yeah, definitely put that on. I'm gonna get 20% extra damage against skeletons and zombies. Whoa. You're starving now, though, about to go on a walk, having not eaten like seven hours? Oh, that's too long. You know what? You're doing intermittent fasting. You're doing it on purpose. It's all on purpose. I am sweating right now. It got really hot in here all of a sudden. There. A bridge. A Bottle cap shortcut. Okay. I'm going to go there. Ah! I slapped them before they could even come at me. Collect the money. So you don't get anything if you slap them before that you can fight them. What's the front side of a happy grape? Uh, don't ask. Bright hoof says zero percent. Okay, I gotta go to Shatter Grave, whatever that is. Is this a box? Ninety proof gin tends to do that. Is that why I'm sweating? Shattergrave Barrow is this way, but what if I went this way? Oh, there's no bridge. What's in here? Toss a coin! Oh, it multiplied! Oh no, I didn't slap him in time! Fuck that guy. I don't even know if I got all the money. Never runs dry! Cultists! Oh, I gotta try my new skill. My new skill. Okay, I lost some health. I lost a little health there. Alright, where are they? There? Is that one? Brigand. Okay, do it. Oh, I think I missed. It hit the bridge. Okay, it'll recharge a sec. I gotta test this new thing out. Okay, they're right over here. I don't think you understand the there, okay. Cast it on him! Get him! How much does it heal? You may not believe uh, a little bit. Hmm. Heal me. Nothing is as good as that uh, ball that falls on their head. I wonder if it has to be like the death, the death attack or the death damage to get the most health out of them. Okay, that guy's almost dead, so I'll try casting a spell at him. Oh, I have no... I don't have low health right now. Ah, uh, now I have lower health, lower health. I'm gonna die in one second, oops. That's what I fucking get. Heal me! Oh, I leveled up! That's the only thing that healed me, shit. I would jump into this water right now in real life. Oh, I would just go right in. No matter how cold it is, I would just 
enjoy it. <sighs> Damn it. How often do I use my treadmill and for how long the sessions last? Oh. Um, if I don't go for a walk outside, I'll use a treadmill three, two or three times a week if I can. But that's actually, ugh. In reality, it's been like once a week and then with like one or two walks. So, and then for how long? At least an hour. An hour if I can. But that's generous. Hey, finally a fire weapon! We're changing that. Better not be a fucking shotgun. Oh good, it's not. Stabomancer. I know I can do it, I'm just- it's really hard being a lazy ass gamer. <laughs> All I want to do is just sit on the couch and watch, uh, stuff on YouTube and- and eat, you know? Speaking of stuff I watched, I watched Jackass Forever, um, and I also watched uh, the first episode of the Halo show that was released, and I also watched Ascension on Paramount Plus, that was cool. Nothing else, though. 427 likes on YouTube, cool! Let's get to 500. I think we can get to 500. I can finally do this. Font of Man. Hey, I didn't get that before. Spell cooldown rate and action skill cooldown rates are increased. Yeah, I want that. Fate Maker guns, stake of spell weaving, fire rate for every stack of spell weaving. Now let's do this one. I want maximum cooldown. Hey, I can get this now? Double spell! As a spell shot with a double spell action skill, you can choose to check in- ah, fuck yeah! Good. Alright, now I can equip two. Finally! So, I have this bullshit spell I'm gonna replace with... Mmm, the Hydras are kinda a cool idea. Hydra of Worrying. This is such a special Hydra one, though. Okay, I'll keep one Hydra. And then I'll put... I think I can I can figure the Hydra spell out. If I just practice. How do I select that? There. And the other spell I want is the Calamity of Recovery is 988... Oh, what's this one? Magic Barrage. Oh no, where did my Calamity go? Mmm, I thought I had another Calamity. That was like, a really high damage. Or high, high chance. Magic Barrage is 40% chance. Mmm. Did I redeem the codes? I did, Steve, yeah. Haven't watched it. Forget how much we hoard these TV services at first. Yeah, on Paramount is good. You're stuck on episode 5 of that Apple sci-fi show. You're thinking you're going to start watching Moon Knight? Oh, the Apple TV. Oh, I didn't finish that. <sighs> calamity. Shit, which Calamity was it? Um, okay, 123 or 113. Put that one on. Wait, new points again still? Oh, hero. Hero points. Spell cooldown. Can I hit this? What is this? I think that is a Cheeto, but I I wasn't sure. You think for sure it's a Cheeto? They look great in 4K, holy shit. Yeah, oh man, everything looks great in 4K. Indestructible cheese puff. Absorbed forever. Why didn't she just absorb the Dragon Lord's soul 
and be done with him. Cause I don't know, he's he's bad, but he's not that bad. <laughs> and what do you do you not want a villain to fight? Huh, Fret? Yeah, Fret. Sucker. <laughs> Find Sword of Souls is my goal. Okay. Follow the unicorn. I mean, Binacorn. Eighteen eighty-three on Paramount. Oh my God! You guys have to see that. It's so good. I've only watched three episodes so far, um, but holy shit! I can see why it's so highly rated. It's just crazy. It's like a 1883, it's like a people, like cowboys kind of thing. Spell shots, vestments of the juggernaut broadside. Area damage, melee damage, no. What is it trying to sell me here? Flat blade of the stunner, critical damage. And it's trying to sell me some spell here. Arcing sunder of ruin. Can't afford it anyway. Casts around the owner, hits enemies, will chain elemental damage nearby enemies. Oh, chain. And it restores health via damage. Ugh. I need these ones. You saw the mustache guy from Big Lebowski in that show? Uh, yeah. What's his. Yeah. Zombos. That's him. Even Billy Bob has a a little tiny part in it, as well as Tom Hanks, which is weird. Let us in there! Stop talking, zombie! Oh, I can kill them! <laughs> Too much talking for a zombie! Let me in there! Oh. Did you hear what she said about me? Not that bad. Nice try. But she can't retcon turning me into the villain and all her <laughs> retcon. No wait, there was that one other guy. The sorcerer, job stealing hack. Handsome though. I love a fire gun! Nothing wrong with that. Except the uh, terrible clip size. But now I get plus 20% damage bonus to zombies and skeletons. Oh, I see them. Alright, I got two spells now. Right, okay. What's that? Is it normal for the YouTube stream to be clear? No, that's very rare. They might have done a, an improvement to something. Thanks, Crustacean. Come on, you shambling bitch! If you like cowboy series, try Hell on Wheels. I watched the first two episodes of that, and I, that's another one that I wish I had finished, or continued at least. I remember really liking it. But the brutality in 1883 is really interesting. Give me that money. That's only 36 for a gold bar. Come on, that should be more. Oh no, shotgun, I don't walk right up to him. I can't help it. Fuse lighter. Oh shit, I don't know what the fuck he does. He's resist fire. Oh shit. Save your soul. Fuck. 
No, not with the shotgun. Oh, man. Can I switch weapons? Yes. Is that a symbol of a heart? I'm gonna stand next to it. It is! Oh my god, that's what that is? Fuck. Keep forgetting, use the oh fucking spell! God. Where'd my Hydra even go? Use that there. <laughs> oh shit, the Zomboss is there, fuck. They're no big deal at all. They were nothing, especially with my shotgun. Oh fuck, never mind. Oh my god, you bastard. I'm okay. A little thing called acting. Maybe you've the avocado is back to being shy. Oh, you gifted a sub to Gerardos. Thank you, Steve, for gifting a sub on Trova. I appreciate it. Welcome, Gerardos. Yeah, it hasn't been working. Um, I've tried re-adding it and redoing it, but I've... I don't know what they're doing over there. Yeah, thank you for trying. I need that cannon. I know, but that's only in certain parts of the map. The Wild West strikes me as one of those nice to visit but wouldn't want to live there kind of places. Uh, yeah, and if you watch any of those TV shows, you would never, ever want to live there. Or even visit, actually. Thanks, Ka. It's a dark <clears throat> magic spell. Ooh. Oh, Elemental Blast. Oh, shit. <gasps> Oh, okay. Um, right now I have the ball and I have the hydras. So shelter is hold and release to cast. That's fire and forget. Damage 26, damage 31. That restores health via damage and it's a blast. So does that, 75%, 83% chance. Let's do that one, equip it left. Ooh, dark magic gives you health stealing powers. Sounds evil, but let's call it morally gray. <laughs> Doing a little grave robbing, huh? I knew you weren't completely boring. I'm still gonna beat you with the sword. Let's go get to know each other. Somewhere nice and quiet. Like your grave! <laughs> I can't appreciate how the uh the areas change. I mean even though the gameplay doesn't really change. I'm getting up there. I mean, we're killing the enemies anyway. There's no reason it could be morally gray at all. Where's that spider? Oh, it's a spider crab like at the beginning of the game. Take that crab. Oh no, that was a fragile crab or something. I guess I have to walk over there, fuck. It ain't like it used to be. You know what, where they would come and walk up to you and just try to murder you themselves? They're fucking lazy now. Steal their soul! Oh, is it the one I have to hold down? It is. I have to hold it down as I do damage. Fuck sakes. But I want magic now, exactly like Willy Wonka. I am healing. Sort of.
I was healing, I think. I don't know what the fuck that thing is. Oh, there's a health barrel here. I'll get that. Thanks, Will Steven. Am I going to stream WWE again, WrestleManias this weekend? I'll probably check it out, but I don't think I'll uh, do a watch along or I'm not sure if I'll play it again. We'll see. It really depends. And I think after this level, we'll be done too. Oh, you bitches! Oh! Am I completely out of fucking ammo for the other thing? That sucks. Shooting me! Oh, a skeleton. Skeleton archer, these guys suck. Blast? Oh, that might have been better. I could always have more. I don't think the custom Oprah can be top for amazing hilarity. No. No. Oh, it's that kind of elemental blast where you charge up and then you shoot it around you. Oh. Oh, my inventory is full. Fuck. Let the magic begin. That's okay. I don't need anything except for this. I think. Hero statue. I could swap this. But what's the difference? Oh, that's fancy. No, it has minus fucking everything. Oh, I don't know. I'll just keep it. Okay, let's see. Boss fight. Better be a boss fight. Find Sword of Souls. Uh, is it in this? See, the horse is neighing at us. Your Majesty says you will need to find the Tome of Fate and read the Fate Maker's Creed aloud to gain entrance to the relic repository below. Mm hmm. Now, Oprah in the glorious song um, on WWE 2K22. Um, I don't think I've seen anything funnier. The Shrek I thought was the funniest, but no. But uh, WrestleMania being this weekend, that's interesting. I've never actually been interested in any WrestleMania. Um, I've never even thought about ever watching one because I've I've seen like I've I've heard about them and been like, oh, I don't really care for wrestling at all whatsoever. Um, but but now, I mean, now things are different, right? Things are totally different. I've played as all the characters, even Oprah and Shrek count. You'll do a Will Smith and slap the Nightbot? No, don't slap the Nightbot. It's the only sport that's not fake. Hey, wrestlers put in so much work into looking and, and like being athletes. I. Even if it's not real punches, it is real performance and they shouldn't be taken any less seriously than any other sport. It's it's very, very hard to make it look like you got punched in the face or the, you know, or even if they miss and they accidentally hit you in the face, like, oh. Could you imagine you just did your makeup and you got all your, you got all your, um, Facial reconstructive surgery done and some asshole just punches you in the face like it's a wrestling match? Like, what a douche. It could happen. So, 
They work really hard. Um, your friend plays guitar for the entrance music of wrestling. That's impressive. That's a pretty big job. Now, you guys, uh, yeah, the stream's over. Uh, I mean, it's ending. It's not over, but it's ending. And um, before we go anywhere, before you go anywhere, um, I want you to stick with me because I'm going to send you somewhere that I think you'll, you'll find entertaining. And someone that I find very entertaining. Oh, and they're playing a game that I really like, actually. Let's get this raid ready. I'm getting that raid ready. Thank you, you guys, so much for watching. Thank you, Steve, for winning the mug. I appreciate you and your stream support. Thank you so much. Thank you also, all hail the paper bag, De Sangua. As well as for the elixirs in Trovo, Steve and De Sangua. Thank you, guys. Thank you also, Tiny Tina, Steve, for winning the mug. Um, and also, Yura and Abram. Thank you, guys. I'm sending you on a raid because uh, I'm really, really hot and I need to cool down and eat something and uh, maybe watch some shows or something. I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.